Welcome to Time to Play GoldenEye for Nintendo 64. This is Ron Moore, and now that I got a new computer, I am able to do 64 games again. For those of you who remember, I did do an LP of Ocarina of Time starting in 2010, and it was very hard to do. The quality was terrible. Now, I get not a, now that I got a new computer, everything is better quality-wise. A few distortions here and there, as you'll notice, in the sound and graphics, but for the most part, decent enough. I am known for low-budget reviews and stuff anyway. So yeah, I've been wanting to do an LP of GoldenEye for a long time now, so here we go, finally. And yes, I'm using a PS2 controller again, just like I did with Ocarina of Time. And yes, I am going to be using ECW mode. How can you not use ECW mode with GoldenEye with all the cheats? When I was in high school, I did unlock some cheats, like the invincibility code, legit. Then I discovered Game Shark. I'm like, dang it, I worked hard for nothing. I could just use Game Shark. But uh, all the cheats have been enabled. Now that I got a decent emulator, worked out all the kinks here. Oh, got shot in the demo screen already. Alright, so here we go. I'm gonna play one of the best games of all time, GoldenEye 007. Alright, let's look at the cheats here. Let's see which cheat I want to use. Invincible, invincibility, obviously. All guns. Gotta have infinite ammo. Bond invisible, not not the first level, not in the dam. Not yet. So, alright, all levels are unlocked. We're gonna play in 007 mode to get the fullness of each level. I don't care about all that. Let's see. Mission objectives. Neutralize all alarms. Install covert modem. Intercept data backup. Bungee jump off platform. Skip all that. I don't care about that. Here we go. So I played this game a lot back in high school. I played this game before I seen the movie. This game got me to eventually watch the movie. And I was never good at multiplayer. And so here we go. The first level with the dam. You know, the sky is black. Little graphic distortion here. I could fix that, I think, with the emulator, but I don't really care to. This is good enough, so here we go. Goldeneye in ECW mode. Time to pwn some people. I'm going to silence people with my silencer. I'm just laughing at him. <laughs> he can't hurt me. And of course, I love the soundtrack in this game. Classic uh, variations of the classic James Bond theme. Yeah. Oh man, I forgot to enable paintball mode. I'll do that next time. Oh, I got all the guns here. There's the AK Soviet Russian gun, whatever it's called. Ooh. that bow with the three stooges these guys gotta be freaking out he's not going down how is he not getting killed hello oh. remember an episode of Conan O'Brien one time what the heck hold on get out of here get out of the truck's way he's trying to get through there was an episode of Conan O'Brien where I think him and Andy were like they had a green screen in the background they were like driving in the city whatever and I think they they filmed themselves inside of, of a Doom video game, which is funny. But when they were shooting people, you heard the Golden Eye sound effects. <laughs> and so I that I popped for that. That was ECW. All right here. Let's neutralize the first alarm here. Oh, a room off? No, not yet. Oh, uh, what? Oh, I thought the next alarm was in here. I guess not. Been a good while since I played Goldeneye. I forgot to do one thing first. That's intercept data backup or whatever this mission objective is called. There we go. All right. That part of the mission is complete. Let's 
I think the farthest I got in this game without cheating was the airplane level, the runway, and double O agent. Let's go down here. Wake up. Now we're gonna have some fun. Oh, now I'm Rambo. What? I wonder who would win out of Rambo and James Bond. I've always wondered that. And I thought Rambo would win in hand to hand combat, obviously. But James Bond, I think, would win if it came down to weapons because he has all those fancy weapons thanks to Q. room I gotta be careful not not to shoot that super computer back there this this does remind me of Rambo he goes in that computer room and the part two in the end he goes ah and he finds Bardock he's like you know the woman out there you know where they are find them or I'll find you all right objective C completed I love this gun too dang I didn't mean to switch guns though am I done here let's see Oh yeah, that's right. Neutralize all arms. Duh. Love that shotgun right there. Just putting in someone's head in this game, just blowing their head off. All right, has a Cougar Magnum. A Cougar Magnum. The most powerful handgun. Wait, that's a 44 Magnum. Dang it, it fell. Eh, whatever. The most powerful handgun in the world. Actually, this is the most powerful handgun in the world. And we blow your head clean off. Dang it, I missed. It won't blow people's heads clean off. I keep missing. There we go. Yeah, you go down to the golden gun. See if I can shoot that guy from here. No. Come on. Dang it. I'm a terrible shot. Not right there. I'm not. All right. All right. There we go. Now we're done, except all we got to do is just jump off the dam, and then we're done. Now what's more dangerous with it than a man with a golden gun? A man with two golden guns here. Alright, time to commit suicide and jump off the freaking dam. And this is not an emulator or ROM glitch right here. Even in the cartridge, you cannot see the bungee cord. So, eh, but well, oh well, whatever. Real cool seeing the movie. And that is the end of the damn level. Alright, so. Next will be the facility, and I will do that in part two. Until then, God bless and take care. Welcome to Time to Play GoldenEye for Nintendo 64 Part 2. I'm going to now enable invincibility and paintball mode for the facility. And the facility is probably my favorite level in the game. I had so much fun in it back when I played it back in high school. And even though I wasn't good at multiplayer, I had fun with it during multiplayer as well. There's a lot of funny stuff that can go on this level. This is the level that you need to beat in double O agent in like a minute and 30 seconds I believe in order to access the invincibility code and man that was one of the hardest things you ever had to do in video games and I remember doing it in high school and it was so epic this before I discovered Game Shark 
and I was like, yes, I finally got the invincibility code, and I used it to just play through the levels as, you know, being invincible, not invincible, invincible, and yeah, man, oh, those are fun times. I want, I just want to use my hands, dang it. I, I just want to smack some, some people around since I'm invisible here. Ugh, he fell face first in the urinal. Alright, who can I smack around here? I'm gonna see if I can just use my regular hands. I thought you can. I thought unarmed also made you use your, just use your hands. Not, no, not a rifle. Whatever, anyway. Thank you very much. And I love the track in this level too. It's freaking awesome. He hit somebody and they're like, well, what was that? Get up, clumsy. Ain't nothing wrong with you. So, now I'm playing as Kevin Bacon here as the Invisible Man. And boy, I would cut you. No, hold up. Dang it, missed. What? How can I hear that though? Oh, I hit his hat at least. <laughs> oh, ouch. How you gonna not even hear those knives hitting the floor? And how you gonna not even notice your hat got knocked off anyway? Oh, he just disappeared. Where'd he go? Let's see what I want to use here. Let's be like Desperado up in here. Now, how's the other two guys not gonna hear that? What? And he just stands there. Oh, 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 what was that? Oh, I guess it was nothing. Is that Dr. Dork? No, it's one of the admission objectives. I gotta talk to Dr. Dork and get the decoder. Which made beating this level in double O agent in a minute and 30 seconds even harder because you gotta be lucky and find Dr. Doak. That was cold. Just shot him in the head for nothing. You gotta find Dr. Doak or Doak or Dork or whatever. And he's in random rooms in this level, so you gotta be, you gotta be lucky. I love those guns, but no. Oh yeah, let me see. Yeah, here we go. Let's just shoot Charlie Haas in the face. Oh. Has nobody else heard that? Oh, stop, sorry, I tried to shoot your hat, not your head. Oh, ouch. I love trolling the scientists. But I do have to minimize scientist casualties here. Only one was killed in the movie, if you remember, by that douchebag 006. You know, I'm trying to make sure I didn't pass up Dr. Dork. Is that him? No. Get out of here. Where could he be? I thought he was in one of these rooms. It's been a while since I played this game, but I really thought it was one of these rooms right here. Wait, oh, wait, I just remembered. There's other scientist rooms further on. Duh, <laughs> let's move on, you idiot. No bond sign. Double shotgun. What? Boom. I like how they're running around. Who, who was that? Was that you? No, was that you? Man, I'm like the most dangerous man in the world right now. Invisible, invincible, and I got all the guns and I can't run out of ammo. Man, God bless the person that put all these cheats in this game. Freaking ECW. Wait, I see somebody? Oh, yep. Pwned. Come on, open up. There we go. Now, is Dr. Dork in here? Is that him? 
Yes, it is. Oh. Dang it, I forgot I'm invisible. You can't see me. Well, then, you have no use to me, then, sir. <laughs> I forgot. Dang it, I forgot. Idiot. You can't rendezvous with the secret agent, or whatever he is, if you're invisible because he can't see you. Well, he can hear me, at least. Hey, it's me. I'm right here. Just give me the freaking decoder. Failed. Yeah, that's that says it all right there. Failed. I feel like an idiot. I forgot. If you're invisible, you can't be seen, so you can't complete the mission. So take off invisibility. Now it's time to pwn. It's about to get real. Beg your pardon, I forgot to knock. No, I'm not trying to take a dump real quick. I'm just, I thought someone else was coming. I guess not. Let's move on. <laughs> Can't get him. Freaking hard hat helmet, mash helmet they got on. Desperado up in here. See if there's any more people to kill or get on the store these glasses. These glass vials or test tubes. Ah! Not destroy the table. What is this, ECW? Yeah, it is ECW. This level right here in this game is an ECW mode, so might as well break a table. It's not ECW if you don't break a table. Okay. I could write ECW with all the paintball bullets if I wanted to, but I don't feel like being that creative right now. Yeah, you better run. All right, the search for Dr. Dork is on again. All these scientists, where's Bill and I at? Whoa! Ugly mother. Boom! Watch out. Did I go to the, that room yet? I think it. I mean, dang it! Leave me alone. I'm not complaining about it. I'm invincible. Yeah, this is Double O Agent. They're out in full powers. Made to sound like Jeff Farmer there. Now I'm coming full. Force. You turned the tables on me. Now you got me mad. Now. Oh, open it up. There you go. It's cool to see all those paintball spots everywhere. Oh. Caught y'all sleeping. I'm feeling boxed in. Yeah, just let everybody know I'm here. Hey, everybody, I'm over here. Come and get me. Wake up. Now go to sleep. Hey, go back to sleep. Oh, idiot, get out of the way. You almost got shot. There's Dr. Dork. Thank you. Time to leave. Time to shut up. 
I wonder if I can kill him now that he gave me the decoder. I'm not sure. I'm not going to take that risk. I don't want to fail this mission again. I just want to destroy some... Some more glass here. Dun 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 Ah, dang it, let me switch to my Dower Decoder. I like this beat right here, too. Alright. What? But how do you... Yeah, hit the... Yeah, I got it selected. Oh, you gotta be at the actual door. Well, well excuse me for trying to do things exactly like the movie. There's 006. Hey. Right, I'm not invisible. No, I can get in front of him, of course. He don't have eyes in the back of his head. It was too easy, Alec. Half of everything is luck, James. And the other half? Fate. Alright, so let me put my remote mines here. Well, I could just shoot the tanks. I mean, I'm invincible and I got infinite ammo and it doesn't matter, but I want to try to do it the way it's supposed to be done. I think you only have six, usually. You got it put him on the right spots and one time I did I failed because I used them all and didn't get to destroy them all at the same time finish your job James blow them out to hell you have 10 seconds 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 Franklin James! <laughs> Alright, now time to kill him bison. Just kidding, can't kill him bison. My mission is complete here. All I gotta do is leave out the door while I wanna I wanna follow him because I think I did follow him before. And I think he what that's supposed to run up here. Where'd he go? I think he runs all the way like toward the beginning of the level. Just toning people with the taser and they got guns and everything. Where are you going, you idiot? See if I can cut him. Boy, I would cut you. I think it. Where would he go? Ah, okay, I think he finally went up the stairs. I'm over here coughing to death, but I can't die. It's like a dog cough. Ah, there he is. Dang, how'd the gas get up here so quick? I think Rumoth's about to be gassed out. He's, I think he's slowing down or I'm just catching up to him easily. Oh, rotten right the neck. Come on, you know that hurt. Get him. Where are you going, idiot? Where you think you're going? Ah, there he is. He just disappears. Just totally disappears into the void. Alright, let's go back here. Now to officially complete the level. They are just waiting on me. Somehow they're not dying from the gas, but okay. I know a room off's invincible right here, just like I am, but they're not. How'd they stop the gas? But anyway. I gotta use the, 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 the door decoder again. One idiot over there. You're still here by yourself. Why didn't you follow everybody else? Where's that door? There it is. Right, mission complete. All right, and that is the end of the facility.
I will see you guys in part three for the runway. Don't you run away now. I fail. God bless. Take care. Welcome to part three of Time to Play Goldeneye for Nintendo 64. I will be invisible, again, yeah, invisible, invincible, all guns, all ammo, and paintball mode, all that good stuff. I can be invisible this time because I don't have to worry about talking to anybody in this level, unlike the previous level where I failed because I was invisible and I couldn't talk to one of the agents, the secret agents, the scientist who was undercover. But I don't have to worry about that here. This is probably the shortest level in the entire game, especially on Agent. Where all you do in Agent difficulty level is just escape an airplane. Alright. Let me go over here. Whoa! Uh, oh, that's right, you can't see me. In this part, I'm playing as John Cena. Okay, I want to get unarmed here. Because I want to smack him around. And not with a gun either. Where's well, I guess, yeah, see, I guess in certain parts you use your hand. Certain parts of the game, certain levels you can, not in this part and previous parts, but whatever. He's pwned anyway. This is kind of weird right here because in the movie, people are chasing you and trying to gun you down. But, uh, for some reason right here, it's not the case. It looks totally different. Yeah, that's right, walk. Yeah, keep walking. You don't see anything. Literally. Yeah, because in the movie, if you remember, he escapes in the airplane. It was epic the way he did it. Everybody's trying to shoot him, and that was a good scene right there. Good opening scene to the movie. Now time to destroy all the drone guns. The first one's over here somewhere, I think. Whoa! whoa. Who's shooting at me? What? I thought nobody could see me. Okay, well, nobody can see me, but the drone guns can. They can detect body heat, I guess. And how is that guy over there not hearing and seeing what's going on? Shut up! Alright, that's fine. I know how to take care of you. Yeah! Now what? Pwn! Oh, oops, I killed that guy over there. Ha! Huh? My bad. Let me see if I hit that guy right here from here. Oh, pwned. Alright, let me destroy the missile battery and not complete objective C. There we go. Ah, another drone gun that can see me. Well, see this. And there's one more over there. Let's see if I can hit it from here. Oh, no. I'm using a tank bullet, not a rocket launcher, but anyway. How come this drone gun can't see me? I guess I'm not in the right spot. Alright, objective B completed. All drone guns are destroyed. What the heck? What, is, what are you doing, you douche? Okay, so... This guy can hear what's going on from way beyond wherever the heck he came from. But the guy standing out here on guard didn't hear or see anything. What the heck? Oh, he's got pwned. Let's see if I can know this guy right here with the knife. What? <laughs> wow, fell. Oh, got right in the shoulder. <laughs> now he's running. Oh! Oh, pwned. Alright, see if anybody else trying to run after me here. Oh, yep. Got two more idiots coming after me. Pwned. I'm gonna silence them. Alright, well that's enough fun with this level. Let's go ahead and escape an airplane. And get out of here, even though I wish they would have shown... They should have made that part of the game right here where... He escapes the way he did in the movie. That was pretty epic. But anyway, the runaway level completed. 
So that is the end of part three. I will see you guys in part four. Where I will face the surface level next. Until then, God bless and take care. Welcome to part four of Time to Play Goldeneye from Nintendo 64. Let me get my cheats going here as I get ready for the surface level. I mean, you know, on the surface, this game is good. I fail. But here's the mission objectives. Power down communications dish, obtain safe key, steal building plans, enter base via ventilation tower. Alright. So here we go. <laughs> the graphics. Graphics looking messed up here on this emulator. Okay, so it says four years ago. So this is one of the levels that's not in the movie. As we're in, still in Russia, and we got more work to do. Look at those polygonal Christmas trees. Now oh, they already see me. Normally, I remember playing this level a lot in agent mode. And you would use your sniper and take out these guys before you just go anywhere. Oh, oh I thought that was blood. No, that was a paintball spot. Oh, shot him in the butt. Now, nah, don't get butt hurt. What are you guys gonna do? Quit rolling around like an idiot. These guys are tough. I think they got bulletproof vest or something. Open the door! What? Man, let me take care of this idiot real quick. Get this guy too. Man, they keep coming, they won't stop. There we go. What jeez, nothing in here. Wait for something. Come on, I dare someone to step through that dough. Come on, I dare you come through there, come on. I'm gonna use my rocket launcher here and See if I can hit the other bunker from here. Where's where is it? There it is. All right. Let me aim right here and ah, dang it! Freaking door closed. Let's get ready to shoot. Ah, shoot! All right, stay open this time. Well, it won't stay open, but I better hurry up and. All right. Oh, got it. Oh, wait a minute. One of those idiots trying to get... Oh, you got lucky. Man, get out of here. I did get lucky that time. They get the door slot. He's not even rocket launcher can blow it open. All right, so we gotta get the key from one of the other bunkers far over here in the level, next to the satellite dish. Got him. First, let me shut down the communications dish. <laughs> Still people shooting at me. Mm. Objective A completed. See if I can blow this thing up. No, you can't. What? Oh, ECW. 
see if I blow up one of these trees. No, it just goes through it. All right, let's go in this bunker right here. Let me. Probably some enemies over there. Let's see if I can kill them from here. Yeah, blow stuff up. Man, not the books. All right, where is that freaking hut key? Do you have it, sir? All right, let's switch it up here. Get, shoot him. Get him. What? Oh, oh, I thought that was a laser watch. Fail. Get the taser. Yeah, yeah, use a, use a taser. Get the taser. <laughs> oh! Get the taser. Use a tank. Whoa. Oh. You ever want some? Man, it's still up. Man, these guys are tough. Hey, oh, oh, nope, that's not a room off, but I got the hut key. I want to sound like Angel there. Now I'm going faster, I guess, because I don't have freaking tank bullets or rocket launchers anymore. Nah, nah, nah. Don't shoot at me, then try to run. Nah. -uh. All right, now that I got the hut key, let's go back over here and get inside the hut. Right and ah dang it! Now I need a safe key too. Jeez, how many more keys I need? Let me make sure. I do I need to equip it? I forgot. I haven't been to this level in years. No, that's the only key I got. Now I gotta go find the freaking safe key, and I forgot where it's at. Well, there's a room off hat. If I'm afraid to blow up the safe. It might not open it, and it might fail the mission. What? Oh, pwned. Oh. Ah, he didn't quite make it out of the way. Ha <laughs> ha. Nice. Now I need to get the building plans from the safe and I should be done with this level. What? You want some? Oh! ECW. The crowd's chanting. The crowd. There is no crowd in the middle. I'm in the middle of nowhere. Alright. I'm going to use the rocket launcher and blow up the satellite dish from here. They'll shut down communications.
I know it's already shut down, but I just want to shoot it. Boom, there goes their cable. Wait, wait a minute. What? Look at that dirt spot. <laughs> what? It's like hovering. It's on the hill. It's kind of like hovering off the, the, the ground. That's hilarious. Anyway. I don't know what I'm shooting at. I just, I'm just i just trigger happy. And I just hit nothing. There, I hit something. Alright. Now I got the key to uh, the safe. So it should be safe for me to go in there and I fail. I'm just gonna get the building plans and then that should be it. Just escape through the uh, ventilation tower. There we go, all right. Now all I gotta do is escape. What are you gonna do, stop me? Oh, wow. Man, come on. He would be blown to bits. I guess the game is already graphic enough with violence. So they can't make it as violent as Rambo 4 when Rambo was slaughtering everybody with that giant machine gun from the Jeep. Oh, what the heck? That's not the ventilation tower, was it? I know I can't get through here, but... I, oh, yeah, that's the bunker level. Uh, oops. Uh-oh. I just, it looks like I set off the alarm. What am I going to do? I guess everybody's going to come after me and kill me. I wish they would come through this door. Yeah, I... Oh, yeah, I'm invincible. So, what are you, what are you guys going to do? Where are they going to come from? Well, yeah, where did they come from? It's the Spetsnaz soldiers, whatever they're called. You gonna run up on me when I got a grenade launcher? Get out of my face. Roll it. What are you gonna do? Roll out of my... Roll out of the way? Well, that's not necessary because I can't freaking aim. There we go. Boom, he's dead. What? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, come on. Hit him. Oh, oh yeah. That was real fancy. There we go. There we go. There's the ventilation tower. All right, then. Whoosh, I got the rocket launcher. Just freaking shoot right there and blow up all the padlocks in one shot. <laughs> look at me. I look so awesome with my freaking rocket launcher. Like, who else wants some? All right, that is the end of the surface level, part four. I will see you guys in part five of the fifth level, the bunker. Until then, God bless and take care. Welcome to part 5 of Time to Play GoldenEye for Nintendo 64. This is Ron Moore and now it's time to play through the bunker. Disrupt all surveillance equipment, copy GoldenEye key and leave original, get personnel to activate computer, download data from computer, photograph main video screen. So we got 5 objectives in this level. And of course, I got my cheats enabled here. And the bunker was in the movie. Dang it. Use the controls here. Alright, try to open the door. Yeah, that's smart. Let's use a loud gun. Let everybody know I'm here. I love this gun. This gun's pretty cool. Wait, someone's shooting at me, at me from behind? What the heck? You guys come from come from behind me. All right, it's like paintball shot, paintball residue, but the bullets are real. Reminds me of Charles Play. What was it? Charles Play two or three, where Andy went to military school and jeez, what the heck? Where Andy went to military school and then Chucky replaced the bullets with 
the paintball bullets or whatever they're supposed to be with real bullets. That was pretty cold. Alright, anyway, now I'm using the Russian gun. We use our own gun against them. Now, dang it, somebody saw me. What? What was that? Huh. Wake up! And they're everywhere. Oh, there's Boris. Where does he think he's going? Oh, he got shot! How, how come he's not dead? Hey, where are you going? I need you. Get back here. He's, wow, he is invincible. Hey, Do Dr. Doug, what are you doing? Freaking traitor. You're supposed to, supposed to be on my side. Freaking douchebag. Okay, so not only am I invincible, but Boris is as well. I guess he was, he was right all along in the movie. He is invincible. Yeah, well, you're not invincible to me, buddy, so do what I say. Get in that mainframe and disable the security. There's still people shooting at me. Oh, wait. Oh, it's more people. What? Oh! Oh, man! Well, he's not invincible to computers exploding. Jeez! Fail! I'm going to kill all you. All you guys are responsible. All you going to die. Let me just blow everybody's smithereens here. For causing me to fail my mission! Destroy everything. Everything is going to be destroyed here. Objective E failed. Doesn't matter if you fail one objective, you fail the whole mission. I'm going to cause more damage than the Golden Eye actually did in this bunker. Speaking of, where are the operators at? The only one you see is Bullies Glishinko. The door is locked. Your face is locked. You didn't hear that? I bet you felt that, though. Well, here comes the captain. What are you going to do? Pwned. That's what you guys get. Don't ever mess with me when I'm trying to finish a mission. Uh, missing. Mission. I'm missing some uh, words to say there. Fist and mailed. All right. Fail, 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 failed. Only I can fail while cheating in a let's play. Reminds me of George Costanza and Seinfeld. Only I can fail at failing. Well, hopefully I won't fail this time. Now, where do you think you're going? Let me get that alarm for you. All right. Man, the camera's tough. I know I gotta shoot the lens, but still. Ah, dang it, need the key card. Destroy this camera real quick. Man, I cannot aim. Remember, remember though, I'm playing with a freaking PS2 controller, but anyway. Get out of here, you bison! A room off, rip off. More like a rip or room or rip off. I oh, fail. Destroy that camera. What? All right. Where do you didn't see or hear none of that? Because of that, you die. All right. Anybody else over here? Nope. 
rainforest over there, pretend like everything is cool. Alright, I'm take a picture of the map to make Skip Rogers proud. I think Skip Rogers will be the bond of uh, the bond the boss of Bond. When you get in the bunker, make sure to take a picture of the map. Alright, got the key card for the computer room. Here we go. You guys need to dive. Ah, right, there we go. Last camera. Home. <laughs> One guy was itching, got caught off guard. Shot him, and then the other guy tried to be fancy and jump out of the way. He jumped right into a bullet. Not feeling boxed in here. Come on, move out the way. Alright. Man, where'd he freaking go? Did he go in the computer room? Oh, what's going on here? Where did he freaking go? Don't tell me he left the bunker. Well, at least let me take care of this mission objective first and copy the Golden Eye Key and throw away the original. Let me equip the key analyzer here. What? What? Oh yeah, that's right. Throw it away. <laughs> All right, I'll check to be completed. But where is Boris? Boris! Boris! Oh, oh, what? There he is. What? No, don't tell me. Don't tell me he can leave. Gotta be careful not to kill him. All right, get back here. Get in here. Okay, I'm afraid if I step out, step foot out that door, the mission will be complete. No, uh-uh. Get back in here. Take me to the mainframe terminal. Bill Gates reject. Get in there. Don't be trying to act all tough and give me a fake Stone Cold Steve Austin walk. Who do you think you are? Remember, you're not invincible with me. Let me see what time it is. Time for me to equip my rocket launcher here in case in case Boris here wants to freaking try something tricky. Feel invincible now? Disable the security. <laughs> Plays a secret character Bon Quiqui here in Goldeneye. Shouldn't take long. It better not. Oh, oh you douchebag. I told you not to try anything. Ah, oh, dang it. Oh. No, I destroyed the mainframe computer. Ah, oh, idiot. Jeez, let me abort the mission. Let's try this mission again for the third time. Now look down here real quick. I guess that's water. Look up in the sky. Oh, I guess now the graphics plugin is working here. Showing the sky now. Uh -uh. Don't touch that. Yeah, that's right. Look me in the eye. Look me in the golden eye. I used to make fun of the name of the game in the movie back then. I used to call it Silver Ear. Whoa! What did you do? Almost blow yourself up, you idiot? Now, nah, that's what you get to being a fancy trying to roll out of the way. You rolled right into a bullet. Pwned? Be 
Careful. Oh, I shot the mainframe. The computer is a good thing it didn't blow up, though. Yeah, paintball on the mainframe computer shouldn't mess up any data. Don't fail this mission for the third time. How are you gonna cheat and still fail? But anyway, take a picture of the map here. Uh, hey, guys, stop shooting at me for a minute. I'm trying to take a picture here. Give me a second. All right. All right, objective for ECW completed. Hey, sir, how are you? Yeah, that's right. Get your hands up. Don't worry, I'm not going to kill you this time. Like an idiot, like I did last time. <laughs> I threw the old key back at him. It'd be funny if that killed him. All right, let me destroy that camera there. Nice. Good aim. Man, leave me alone for once. Hey. Hey. Get to the mainframe terminal. Idiot. Alright, now while he's doing that, I gotta hurry up and um, as soon as he accidentally sets off the alarm, I need to download data here. Ah, dang it, I know that. Alright. I hurry up and download the data here. Alright, completed. You. That's what you get for pulling that stunt. Alright. Destroy that camera. Nice. All right. Now all I gotta do is escape and get out of here. What are you guys gonna do? Why am I using a silencer right now? No use. But whatever. Oh, I guess my silencer finally silenced the alarm. Well, you guys still stand there. You're supposed to be in panic mode here. I'm going to turn the alarm on for you since it went off, idiots. Alright, that is the end. Uh, mission 5, the bunker. Alright, so I'll see you guys in part 6, where I will take on the silo. Until then, God bless and take care. Welcome to part 6 of Time to Play GoldenEye. Let me get my cheats enabled here as I take on the silo level. Love the track in this level. Okay, plant bombs and fuel rooms, photograph satellite, obtain telemetric data, retrieve small, uh, retrieve small, retrieve satellite circuitry, and of course, minimize scientist casualties. You can't kill the scientist where you can kill one I think on double O agent mode that's it another level that was not in the movie and there's a time limit so we gotta get going Wake up! Alright, give me that key card. This part of the circuit board. Where's the key card at? There it is. Don't mess with me. Alright, now let me equip my plastic explosive. Alright, move on to the next room. Ah, oh, dang it, I'm, I forgot to equip my gun again, there we go. Ah, 
Get out of the way, Seth Green. Alright. Wait a minute. <laughs> yeah. Ah, oh, dang it, I hit the steps. There we go, blow up the dumb drums from Donkey Kong Country. Might be the same dumb drums. I mean, Rare made this game as well. Alright, pwn them. Let me switch back to regular gun here, because I don't want to blow up anything in these rooms and kill all the scientists and blow up stuff that I need to take a picture of or whatever it is. It's been a while since I've been to this level. Nah, that's not the shotgun I want. I want the automatic shotgun. There we go. Oh, pwned. Pwned. Alright, give me the key card. Thank you. Plastique, explosive, onto the wall there. Go on to the next room. Apologize for for this. I've been having problems with the controls here lately. Pwned. What? Pwned. Oh! oh! I thought that was blood on the door. No, that's the paintball. Paintball residue. Oh! I barely missed that guy at first. Oh, uh, gotta be careful not to shoot the scientist. All right, got the uh, data, whatever the heck it's called. All right, get some more of this circuitry over here. Well, I'm trying to get the key card. What? Where's the? Maybe this is the. Hold on a second. Maybe this is the room where I don't need the key card. There's one room where you don't need the key card. But I think that's the last one, not this one. No, it's not. Well, where's it at? Don't tell me they ran off with the key card. Oh, there it is in the corner. Alright, here we go. What? Get up! Uh. <laughs> Jeez. The Seth Green again. All right, this should be the final room. Where'd you go? Get up! Oh, right in the head! All right, I gotta take a picture of this satellite, satellite thing, whatever it is. There we go. Yeah, one more plastic plastic explosive to plant. All right. Heh. <laughs> I want to do something here. I want to blow it up. Uh. Nice. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, I forgot. Plastic explosive. Hello. You'll destroy everything. Fuck, what is this? Hey, there's a room off. Well, look at this. It's like a freaking suicide bomber in here. I'm <laughs> killing everybody in my path because of the explosion. Nice. That's hilarious. Of course, you can't kill a room off. He's invincible for now. See what else I can destroy over here. Is anybody else a kill?
Nope, alright, let me go ahead and try to leave. There we go. <laughs> he just easily puts the rocket launcher away like it's nothing. What the heck? It already it already exploded, but anyway. Alright, so there's the end of part six, the silo. That was spun toward the end right there. See you guys in part seven, the fridge refrigerator, whatever it's called. Till then, God bless, take care. Welcome to part seven of Time to Play Goldeneye. As I am now on the frigate fr 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 forget it, I can't pronounce it. Frigate. Yeah, friggin' forget it. Alright. The boat level. <laughs> what? Freaking graphics plug in once again. Look at this, I'm in the darkness in that void. Must be water and sky, nothing but darkness. Look at that. Something's out there watching me. Ah! It's freaking scary. Seriously, imagine being on this boat and then just looking out into the darkness like I'm in a freaking Bermuda Triangle or something. It's supposed to be just joining this LP. Yeah, this is, uh, just emulator problems I got going on. But anyway. Alright, so. I got risky that. Jeez! One ho one hostage executed already. These guys don't play around. Alright. Man, they're mad. They're coming after me here. Alright, one hostage released. And oh wait! What are oh, you idiot? I Jeez. Those guys blow up the computer station and the hostage run, runs right into the explosion. So I guess not really an idiot. He was trying to escape and he got blew up. Jeez, well that, wow, failure already. Alright, so if I'm cheating and I fail, what do I do? I cheat harder. This time I'm going to be invisible too. So that I can stealth, stealthily rescue the hostages. So Metal Gear Solid with your stealth camouflage eat your heart out. This is real stealth right here. <laughs> it's going to be invisible. As I try this again. Yeah, this level is, it's, this track and level is not one of my favorites. Not that it's bad, it's just compared to the other ones. Just not as fun to me. But anyway. Yeah, what now? Can't see me. I'm on John Cena mode. Bro, what was that? Alright, you dude. I know you can't see me. That don't mean you can't escape. So get out of here. Trying to be careful and not shoot the hostages. Alright. What'd you swat at? Dude, I almost shot you. I thought you were an enemy. Now hurry up and get out of here. Jeez, we're going in circles here. All right, where am I going? Uh, well, he's going down. Pwned. Yeah, double assault rifle. What now? All right, here we go. All right, let me plant the tracking bug on this helicopter. Alright, there we go. Let's move on. What is that? I forgot. Can you blow it up? Nope. 
see if I shoot through these blades. Well, I can. I thought they would ricochet back. But even if they did, I can't feel it because I'm invincible. But anyway. Alright, where am I at now? Okay, now I'm going toward the engine room. Get out of the way, Dr. Dork. Alright, here we are. Like you didn't hear that. Well, I probably couldn't because it's a loud freaking engine. Alright, I'm defuse this bomb here. How do I. Ah, oh, idiot! Oh, I just killed some people down there too. Probably a hostage. Jeez, moron! That's not how you defuse the bomb. There's a certain way about forgot. Wait a minute. I knew it. Bomb defuses. <laughs> That's what defuses the bomb. Not with your hands. The wrong way, you idiot. Well, I always wanted to blow up on YouTube, and I just did. Alright, so starting again, as I failed the mission twice while cheating. Well, here's the other bomb. Get out of the way, idiot. Okay, now that I know how to do this the right way, let me try this again. Alright, there we go. Alright. Now, time to get off the boat. I believe that's all the mission now Jeff has done. Oh, I, I mean, after this, of course. Do this again. Alright. Ah, uh, wake up. I'll go back to sleep. I love this gun also. Open up! Oh, dang it, back in this room again. Now, I know I'm invisible, but you can still hear me coming through. I'm going to stand there after hearing those gunshots, but anyway. Alright, that is the end as I go back into the abyss here in this dark void. That is the end of part 7 of Time to Play Goldeneye. I will see you guys in part 8, where I will ret return to the surface. Uh-oh. God bless. Take care. Welcome to part 8 of Time to Play Goldeneye. Now, let me get my cheats enabled, and I am about to, once again, take on the surface. The surface part 2. This time is dark, and I gotta go back there and, I guess, take care of some unfinished business. So here we go, with the surface part 2. Usually the sky is red, but it's black. For those of you just joining this LP, just now watching this LP, it's uh, my emulator, the graphics plugins messed up, so this game's not going to display right. So here we go. Ah, that's what you get for being all fancy. I like how after he rolled, then that's when he died. I guess that's how he rolls. Well, he got Rick rolled. Love the track in this level. Really fits it. It's all quiet and cold and yeah. All right, trying to make in my mind which gun I want to use. These seem legit. They're loud, but. What's going to happen? Are I going to attract attention? Are they going to kill me? No, because I'm invincible. Okay, nothing in there. Nothing in there either. What are you guys going to do? What do you want? from here. Oh, nice. Bullseye. Alright, let's head toward the satellite. Well, no, first, that's right. I got to disable all surveillance. I mean, destroy all the security cameras. I 
Alright, there's one. I think there's four more. Alright, you. Give me the key to the tower. There you go. Yeah, I'm a pain in the neck, am I? I really am, man. I'm a pain in the neck to a lot of people in this game. Where would you come from? Jeez. There we go. Not oh, waste of time. Dang, what? Man, they're just coming from everywhere. But let's roll and then die again. You not hear what's going on. Alright, let me destroy this camera right here. I think that's two I destroyed so far. I think that's two already lost count. Alright, let's destroy these barrels for fun. Because it's barrels of fun. Ah, fail. <laughs> I love the sound of reloading. Alright, destroy camera number three. There's nothing in those barracks, I'm sure. Whoa. <laughs> Rolling downhill like an idiot. Yeah, things are going downhill for the enemies in this game. This LP's going downhill. Alright, let's go to the communications room now. Destroy this camp. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna shut off communications. Oh, wait a minute. What? Hold on a sec. Why are you gonna shut it down? Back here again. This is how you do it. Alright. Oh, okay, who's shooting at me? You wanna damage it for me, idiot? Alright, so. Got that part of the mission complete. Now let's plant the explosive on the helicopter. Oh, what the heck? I'm stuck. Oh. Alright, so let me put the proximity mine or remote mine, whatever the heck I put on here. Alright, get away from there. Even though it can't hurt me because I'm invincible. Gotta wait to get confirmation before leaving so I can make sure the mission is complete. All right. Get in there. Ha! So long, suckers. Oh, shoot. Guys, I was just kidding. Guys? Oh, man. Welcome to Time to Play GoldenEye Part 9 for the Nintendo 64. This is Ron Moore and I'm getting ready for the Bunker 2. Going back to this level, or not actually back to this level, but back to this area of the game where James Bond gets captured and now he has to escape. And this is the introduction of Natalia in the game. I actually like this track right here, but it also reminds me of times when I was in high school and I would be bored and this song would appear in my head. <laughs> I guess it reminded me how boring things are. And of course, high school, my sophomore year was a time where I really played this game a lot. Alright, so here's the debut of N Natalia. So when they threw me in jail, they didn't completely, completely disarm me because I still have the rifle here in my hand. 
All right. And again, this is Natalia Freyodronova Simonova Supernova. James Bond doing his usual charm here with women. Yeah, they threw me in jail. They think I'm unarmed. So Natalia talks about how she witnessed a room off steal the golden eye. Even though in the movie they meet in the archives, in this game, the archives level. Where they're being interrogated actually in the, uh, in the archives level, not in the actual bunker. Alright, so James Bond says he has a cunning plan to escape. So let me try to get the guard over here. I'm trying to get his attention. Hey, guard! Look, I have a knife! What are you going to do? Get over here! Be nice if you can hear the clink, clinging noises as you hit the knife against the bars, but the game is not programmed that way because it thinks you're unarmed right now. That guy's ugly. Man, he's not falling for it. But what? Don't get smart with me. All right, so let's try this again. I'm going to blow this guy away with a rocket launcher. See how he likes that. Uh, yeah, what? Oh, oh, sorry. My bad. See what happens when I shoot him. Really? You're just gonna still walk around like a punk? <laughs> okay. Alright, let's get for real this time. Let's get out of here. Get my watch magnet. You better watch out. Stop while my mom will shoot. Alright. Dang, what? Dang it, I was using the watch magnet. What am I gonna do? Attract him to me? What do I find him attractive? Ugh. Alright, let's go. Oh, that guy's even uglier. Man, the enemies in this game are freaking ugly. Alright, time to have some fun. Jeez, if I can aim right. Oh, what? That hit him. There we go. Oh! My skills have been sharpened. Oh, <laughs> nice. Oh, now that hit him in the head. Come on! Oh! All right. I need a safe key. Do one of these guards have it? Oh, there it is. What? The safe is locked. What the heck, man? What, what, what kind of game is this? Get that out of here. So if that's not the safe key, then what the heck? It's been a while. I play this level, so I guess you gotta get a different safe key. I don't know what the heck. All right, let's go this way. Oh, what was that you dropped? A key card. We should go to the main control room. No. What you need to do is go in the kitchen and make me a sandwich. Nice. Get my Desperado guns here. That's 
right, let's go this way. Oh, shoot, I'm trying to shoot that camera. Jeez, really? I'm not good when it comes to aiming at cameras. There we go. Whoa, what the? Oh, yeah, she's invincible too. So we got three invincible people in this game. Me, Natalia, and Boris. Jeez. I got that body armor on. Oh, what? Yo, nice maneuver. Get out of here. All right, got the clipboard. I like how she's walking around all calm, even though all this gunfire is everywhere. Yeah, I try to be sneaky. Whoa! All right, did they drop anything? Any keys? Anything I need? I guess not. Let's go. Whoa. Another camera. Uh, I almost shot you, woman. Thought you were the enemy. All right, got the tape. I'll try to be completed. Yeah, I've been here before. Got the mainframe room. Oh, don't shoot the computers, you idiot. Oh, man, just shot her point blank, and she's still alive. Man, that same ugly guy again. He's everywhere. I thought it was a camera right there. <laughs> What's he swatting at? All right. Okay, so Go is about to launch. Or is about to fire. Dang it! If I can hurry up, get the safe key real quick and get out of here. And I don't know what the heck. Jeez. I thought I'd try it again in case I happen happen to have it. I mean, do I have another safe key in my arsenal? Is it safe to assume I'm not going to beat this level on time? I also got to get the casualty list, and I forgot what that was. So yeah, I'm about to die. I'm about to, might as well just start over. So I'll see what happens. I guess everything explodes. I forgot. No, I'm dead. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. That's right. I'm invincible. Hello, duh. I forgot. So this scene looks similar to the silo level where everything's blowing up. Oh, nice. Well, Natalia escaped. That's good. Objective C completed. Yeah, but mission still failed. She's waiting for me. Like, Hurry up, you idiot. She's standing out there. I thought... Golden Eye just launched all over Sevenaya. How did she survive the blast? But anyway. So let me try this again. I know I could have still completed the level for one and two, but forgot where to find the safe key I need and get the casualty staff list or whatever the heck, so I had to go look on YouTube and find out. Dang it, stop using your magnet. Alright, there we go. Hurry up.
Oh. So that's a safe key, but what the heck? I mean, for what safe? It, it don't work for this safe. There's any other safe in the game? Maybe that's how you get the casualty list? I forgot. Look at that. That's just... I don't remember that going down like that. But anyway, I gotta get the key card again. Oh, dang it. Come on. Oh, yeah, I'm a backstabber. I use my PPK. Oh. And those paintballs are lethal. Wait a minute. Ah, that's right, the drone guns. Nice. All right, got the key card. Audio sounds slightly different again because of the audio plug-in. Another key card, all right. Dang it, shoot the camera, shoot the camera. Hurry up. Ah, jeez, right when I shoot it, it spots me. Oh, well, I'm invincible. What are they going to do, kill me? All right. Clipboard again. No, these guys are ticked off. They're the ones that they're the ones that are coming out because the camera spotted me. They can't move. I'm surprised I haven't shot her yet. I, I know I'm not the only one actually accidentally was shooter a lot back then. There's a video on YouTube somewhere. It's called Golden Eye Real Life, and it's that's funny. It's all about Natalia getting shot. Check that out. Man, these guys can repair. They got body armor. They got these Desperado guns and other guns. Look, yeah, I gotta be careful not to shoot Natalia. Not to shoot Natalia Nightheart from the WWE. Man, that guy got it bad. Ah, hats off to you. Dang. <laughs> Look at that's pathetic. I shot everywhere. Come on. How can I still miss the camera? Man, these guys don't play. Neither do I. Another camera. All right, got the tape. Hey, idiot, over here. Oh. Dang, that guy was tough. Well, of course, body armor. Whoa. These guys got semi ECW mode. Shut up. All right. Oh, what the? Oh, the, I guess that's a casualty list. I even see that there. I forgot. I guess I thought you had to give him a save. All right, well. Oh, so I do need to disable all security cameras. Oh, jeez. I well, I forgot about that. Ugh. Move. One when you almost got shot again. Like, make up your mind where you're gonna go. That camera spot me from the side. What the heck? All right, there's the other camera. Look at that. It was up close. I still missed it for the most part. All right, quick cut through here. Oh, try, I gotta try not to hit the target with these knives.
It's fun just to switch up the guns every once in a while. Can't use a rocket launcher right now because I killed Natalia. What? What? What camera spotted me? Oh, yeah, that's right. Shut up. All right. I think there's two more cameras left. Whoa, hello. All right, no. Checking my mission objectives again. I still, still got to get that manual. Where's the other freaking safe key at? I've been everywhere. Oh. Oh. Oh, but well, there's a safe key. Well, there we go. Finally. Jeez. It was in there the whole time. <laughs> I think there's one more. Yeah, one, two more cameras left. <laughs> These guys roll out their way slow. Yeah, my face danced a minute. There's the last camera, and no, it's another one. We're at. All right, Tar, you go ahead and act, a accidentally activate Gold Knot to launch, even though you blame it on a room off. If you would stayed away from that, it wouldn't happen. But uh, it doesn't matter. I can't die anyway. As long as she gets out, everything's good. Because I'm invincible, so I'm gonna go ahead and look for this last camera. Is it in here or? Oh, there it is. Hello. <laughs> Shut up. What are you going to do? All right. So let's get out of here. Yeah, you idiots might want to move. I uh, said so you idiots might want to move because Go Knight's about to launch. All right. Let's get out of here. All right. Finally. Oh, Natalia almost got shot. All right, so that is the end of GoldenEye Part 9. All right, ECW. All right, guys, so I'll see you in Part 10. We'll ever be in the statue level. Oh, things going to get very interesting right there. All right, God bless. Take care. Welcome to Time to Play GoldenEye, Part 10. Now I am about to start the statue level. Where I will come in contact with Valentin, who is in the movie. He's like an old enemy of James Bond. So yeah, this level right here, it's kind of a maze because all these freaking statues that are going to be in the way and stuff. So if you remember the movie, you know what's going to happen here. This is where Bond meets Yanis for the first time. Or is it the first time he's met Yanis? Right, so here we go. And that guy was shooting nonstop like Rambo. I like how these guys roll. They roll all slow, thinking they're fancy, trying to outmaneuver me. Where'd you come from? Well, using the silencer, might as well not do that. Well, well, again, it's fun to toggle between all these guns. These are one of my favorites right here. And for those of you who are just joining this LP, yes, I am cheating. I've been cheating the entire time. This game is a lot more fun when you cheat. Yes, I want to use these guns for now. <laughs> nice hat, nice colorful hat. 
He got killed by the paint fumes. All right. Love this track right here. It sounds heroic, like I'm winning right here. And it's starting to get all heroic and stuff. All right, so let me try to found, find, found. Let me try to find Valentine. I know he's hiding in an orange trailer. It's been a while since I've played this level. It's been a while since I've played this whole game. Sometimes you get lost. It can kind of be amazed. All these freaking statues and blocks, tanks, whatever the heck these are. Thanks for helping me find Valentine. All right, here we go. I think they saw me come. Yeah, they're about to come in here. These are strange times. Yeah, your face is strange. A little different from the movie right here. These two actually meet in Valentine's office. Not so much in the park, but anyway. I know I don't expect the game to be exactly like the movie. So I'm not really complaining, but just saying. All right, get out of here before I shoot you. Now, actually, Valentine's pretty cool. He's kind of a cool villain. All right, so time to find that statue of where I'm supposed to meet Yanis and his men. Look over here real quick. What is all this stuff? Yeah, I did a quick cut right there because I had to stop. And Idiots just blew himself up or someone... Meant to hit me, the, hit me with a grenade, and then end up blowing up their partner. Idiots. All right, so trying to find that statue. I'm probably going the wrong way here. I think it's somewhere on my right. <laughs> I like how you shoot him in the helmet. And you can see the paintball residue, and it looks cool. What's this, a soup Nazi? No soup for you! All right, now we gotta find that statue. Come on now. You gotta hear you, douchebag. Oh. think this is the right path right here wait now ah, you missed yes it is all right now we're going toward the statue not the statue of liberty but the statue of ecw all right this is where i meet yanis so i gotta wait for them to come out there they come No, make me put the gun away. Go after him. See where he goes. <laughs> yeah, I know I failed the mission, but I'll come back to that later. Hey, where'd he go? He's fast. Oh, I barely see him. I think I've done this before. I don't know if I actually follow him to where he's going to stop and disappear. Just like I followed the room off in the facility. There he is. Got to get him. Of course, I know I can't kill him, but... It's fun to still chase him. Oh, oh you're dead. Wait, so... <laughs> he can't make him his mind where he's going? I guess it's the farthest he goes. Yeah, all right. Let me see what happens when I go after him without shooting him. <laughs> he still runs. Yeah, you better run, punk. All right, for real this time. Let's find out who this Yanis is. What? Alec? Trevelyan 006? What? Wow. Why, Alec? I trusted you, Alec. 
So, Alex been alive for this past nine years. Wow. So here we go. Yeah, right. Like this knife's gonna do something. Well, it could. I mean, they can't kill me. Yeah, let me get my AR-99, whatever the heck it's called. Where is that? That Cougar Magnum. The most powerful handgun in the world. Where is that? Oh, wait, I think I'll just pass it up. Idiot. I just seen it. There it is, AR-33. All right, gotta get to the helicopter. About two minutes, 45 seconds. Uh, no, don't. What? Don't go up the ramp. What is this, Excite Bike? Yeah, roll out of here. Once we get lost again, the helicopter blows up. Those guys are using my favorite shotgun in the game. No time to goof off. Need to find Italia. Dang it. Oh, I thought I got stuck again. Man, am I going in circles again? Am I going the right path? That's what I'm talking about. Here we go. All right, found the chopper. Get up. Get up. All right, come run this way. It's a cool scene in the movie where they were in the helicopter strapped in there and the way uh, Bond escaped with Natalia, that was pretty cool. All right, helicopter's destroyed. Now we got to find the flight recorder. Oh, there it is. Well, it made it easy for me this time. All right, now, let's get the heck out of here. Oh, shoot, what? Hey. Who are you, douchebag? Michigan. For those of you who don't know, this is the same actor. The same actor plays Michigan, played as the bad guy in Bad Boys, Martin Lawrence and Will Smith. No, I remember who you are in Bad Boys. Get out of here. No, you killed Natalia. You all die. Ah! All right, let's get for real this time. Let's get out of here. <laughs> they didn't even unarm him. They let him walk out with the gun still in his hand. Smart. Well, anyway, that is the end of part 10. I will see you guys in part 11 in the archives. Until then, God bless and take care. Welcome to part 11 of Time to Play Goldeneye. I am now about to face the archives level. And so, yeah, where Bond and Natalia have been captured and they are being interrogated, or at least Bond is being, well, so is Natalia. You got to go find her. Yeah, so this is going to be a lot of fun. This is not your normal library here. No douchebag librarian telling you to shh. Or if they do, you can shoot her. <laughs> I'm supposedly unarmed, but they are letting me stand there with a rifle in my hand, okay? I 
told you douchebags that Rumov stole it. He's a traitor. No, he's not. He's a douchebag. Your mom's a terrorist. Natalia witnessed the whole thing. Oh, shoot. <laughs> See that guy, like, what the heck was he doing there? Nice maneuver. Well, come on, guys. I thought you were going to kill me. What's wrong? Oh, that's right. I'm in ECW mode. You can't do nothing. I will cut you. I'm trying to... Oh, I don't want no knives. I want a gun right now. Okay, there we go. All right, I got the door key. What the heck? What'd you come? <laughs> They're just dropping down the stairs right there. Whoa, stop blowing stuff up. What? Who's shooting at me? I can't see anybody. Oh, over here, hot behind boxes. And I'm back here. Ooh. Just shoot your own man, why don't you, you idiot? These guys are back here behind these boxes on a smoke break. I don't know why I'm using a silencer right now, but oh well. It's fun to switch it up. Ooh, someone got executed. Now I do the executing. Go up the stairs. Got my desperado gun. This track's kind of cool. Whoa, hey, what that whole thing just blew up in my face. Why does every box in this game explode? I guess they have explosives in them all the time, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, step into my office. I dare somebody. Come on. What's wrong, huh? Mm, just slowly killed him. Okay, so let me find Natalia. Or Defense Minister Michigan first. What doesn't matter. Is that Santa Claus or Dr. Wiley? Or Dr. Light? Alright, Natalia, where are you? You're up here somewhere. Wake up. Come on, you gotta be on your guard. What? What? Where's she at? Oh, hey, where'd you come from? Yeah, I know. We need to talk to Defense Minister. Defense Minister, Michigan. Well, move out of the way. Yeah, I know that. Shut up. Hold on a minute. See where she at? Let's see if she's still following me. Yeah, she is. All right, so now I gotta find Michigan, and I forgot, totally forgot where the heck he's at.
see if I can hit him. Yep. Boom. Oh. Oh, shoot. I made him mad. He's coming after me now. That's all right. I'm ready for him. What? What? He also wants some. Oh, wait. Oh, we got some more soldiers coming. <laughs> what you going there for? Why not come straight toward me? <laughs> he's he's trying, to, trying to roll, trying to do another fancy maneuver. That's not going to work. What? Oh, I thought Italia was shooting at me. Like, you traitor. Defense Minister Michigan. Man, to get Master P, these are this game has no limit soldiers. Like unlimited soldiers keep on coming after you. He didn't even make it up the stairs. Yeah, what? Oh, that guy dropped a grenade. Huh. Oh, wait a minute. What? What what did I fail? Escape when Natalia failed. How? What oh, did she run into the explosion? I didn't even see her come in here. I I guess she was following me. Well, let me start over here. With the target being alive, hopefully they won't drop another grenade right here. And yet it was kept. Oh, well, they did. But the target is nowhere in sight, so. Alright. So, once again, let me go find Michigan. Ugly guy again. Yeah, you better run. Too late though. I got to find a target again. All right, this time don't be an idiot. Now where are you going? Jeez, I gotta go look for it later. Oh, that guy got it bad. Oh, this guy just threw a grenade at me. You missed. Okay, Natalia's probably up here. She usually hides up here. No? Well, where did she go? Great. Now I gotta go look for her again and Michigan. I'm tired of playing this game of hide and go seek. Where are you guys? Especially you, Michigan. I can't even freaking find you. Wait a minute. Ah, there we go. Thank God. Yes, I told you it was a traitor. Even trusted friends are capable of betrayal. Yep, Bond knows that by experience. Oh, you better watch out. So in the movie, Michigan gets killed by Rumoff, but not in this game. That's good, because he is one of the good guys, so he should, uh, he should not be killed. All right, goodbye, Michigan. I got my face before I shoot you again like I did in the last level. All right, so now I got to look for Natalia. 
This is probably the kitchen. Open the door, you idiot! Okay, this is where I would escape with her, but I don't have her with me because she ran off. Huh? There you are. All right, let's get the heck out of here. All right, finally, that's over with. Look at them standing there like they go hard. All right, so that is the end of the archives. I will see you guys in part 12. We'll be taken to the streets. Till then, God bless and take care. Welcome to part 12 of Time to Play Goldeneye. Well, we're about to take this to the streets. So, Rumoff has got Natalia, and I gotta chase after him and rescue her. First, I gotta contact Valentine. And I gotta try not to kill too many civilians. Alright, so here we go. Yeah, these guys are ready for me, that's alright. I'm ready for them too. It's funny because this is where you can use the tank, but I don't even need it because I got un unlimited tank bullets. Alright, there's the tank, yeah. There we go. <laughs> this level's so much fun, you just run over to these guys. Wait, let me get my tank bullets ready as if, if I really need it, but oh well. Alright. Remember that movie Tank Girl? Man, that's the old school. Alright. Well, I hope he has insurance. That might be funny. Alright, look out, innocent civilians. <laughs> nice. Ah! Idiot just calmly walked toward the tank and started shooting it. Like you idiot, I'm out to run. Well, I think the explosion got him before I did. Oh, ouch. Nah, the explosion got him too. Alright, now, dang it, I forgot to look for Valentine first and I forgot where he's at. Weird. Did he get squashed? Oh, nice. This is going to be fun. Oh, I think that guy, he blew up, and then I still ran over him after that. Ugh. Okay, I'm going to fail this mission right here because I forgot where Valentine is, but I'll look for him later when I try the mission again. Oh, now the tables have been turned. Idiot just blew himself up. Now they got rocket launchers coming after me, but I'm invincible, so they can't do anything. Yeah, so I'm going to, as I stated a few minutes ago, or a few seconds ago, I'm going to start over here in a second, because I'm trying to figure out, I'm looking for, where, where's Valentine at? Like, I totally forgot. Why do I have the laser guns equipped automatically when I leave the tank? It's weird. Because I have all guns enabled, I guess that's the next guns in, in line in my arsenal when I'm not uh, having the tank bullets equipped. Okay, well... Seriously, I'm trying to remember where Valentine... Okay, and I'm back in the beginning again. I forgot where he is. I think he's inside a building, right? Can I get in this Jeep? No, I fell. He's supposed to be inside of a building. Is it one of these buildings here? Where's the opening at? You can't open these doors like you can in everywhere else in the game. I thought I'd be over here in the alley. He's hiding somewhere. And I forgot. Okay, that's not him. That's a innocent civilian. Excuse me, sir. Come here. Where's Valentine? Now get your teeth fixed. All right. Where are you at, Valentine? Oh, wait. You want some? Get out of here. Oh, look out, civilian. Pwned. All right. 
All right, so I'm gonna start over right here. Finally figured out where he's at. He's hiding this building over here. Let me get past these douchebags. All right, because it's been a long, long time since I played this game, much less this level. He is in here. What? What the heck? I know he's near somewhere. There you are. Get over here, you fat faced mother. All right. No time for chit chat, Valentine. I'm on a time limit here. Yeah, what's it for you, Valentine? Okay. Good reason. All right. Objective A completed. We talked to Valentine. He's going to make a phone call to his quote unquote associates to slow down a room off. All right. We got six extra minutes. Nice. All right. Here we go. As Al Bundy would say, let's rock. I love this part in the movie where he just gets that tank and just goes on a rampage through the streets to try to get to a room off. Good stuff. Get out of the way, idiot civil. This game calls them. Oh, I think I got, I got blown up and squashed at the same time. This game calls these people innocent civilians, more like idiot civilians. Let's just run into the line of fire and run right in front of a tank. And I wonder how you beat this level without cheating on Double O Agent. I gotta check it out. Check it out on YouTube. There are the WWE Roblox. Fail. Oh. Alright, where's that exit at? Oh man, I would be dead if I wasn't cheating. What is that? Oh, bulletproof vest. <laughs> I don't need that. Oh, look out. Oh, you idiot, he's gonna get blown up. Oh, I love how you can just run over these mines and nothing happened. This reminds me of Iron Tank for NES. I guess this is what Iron Tank looked like on 64. I do remember Battle Tank on Super Nintendo. <laughs> you try to move out of the way, you got squashed. Oh, uh, uh, you got to be quicker than that. There's the exit. All right. Let me shoot this guy real quick before I leave. Oh, come on. What? And I'm aiming right at him. Man, forget it. Let me jump out this tank and just shoot him. But just forget it. I'm just going to leave. He's not even worth it. Yeah, look at me walk off. Without looking back as everything explodes. All right, so that is the end of part 12. I will see you guys in part 13. Where I will be in the depot. No, it's depot. I know People are going to start correcting me. It's Depot. You said it wrong. It's pronounced Depot, not Depot. <laughs> All right. God bless and take care. Welcome to part unlucky 13 of Time to Play Goldeneye. Will I be lucky in this level? Let's find out. As I'm in the depot. 
destroy illegal arms cache, destroy computer network, obtain safe key, recover helicopter blueprints, locate Yanis's base or train or whatever. All right. Dang it. See, I hate this graphics plugin. This emulator it won't show the beautiful blue night sky or blue cloudy night sky, whatever it was originally. All right. I want to switch to my AR-33 assault rifles. Yeah. Wake up. Go back to sleep. All right. So go through here. First thing you need to do is get the safe key and then destroy the network. Not the WWE network for only $9.99. You don't want to destroy that network. That would not be ECW. All right. You'll be on Ramble here at the end of part two. Just destroy all these computers and stuff. Ah! Ooh, I shot him with a butt. Oh, he's butt hurt. Ah! Let's shoot that drone gun real quick. Shut up. Oh, what? <laughs> Did I even hit it? Get the safe key first. Yes. All right. Ah! All right. Objective A should be completed. Why? What the heck's going on? I destroyed all the computers. What is? What else is there to destroy? I don't get this. Oh wait. Objective B completed. Excuse me. You gotta destroy. Destroy the freaking big screen TV. All right. Whoa. Surprise. Picked up a deep arcade douche. Think of going here next. Yeah, destroy the weapons. And huh, you see that guy? He just dropped down from the top, just walked down and landed on his feet, and nothing happened. All right, so I got to destroy all these weapons. Let's do that the fun way with a rocket launcher. You know it. All right, get the other one and. What? What the heck? Did you see that? The rocket just went through the ground. It even hit nothing. What was that about? All right, anyway, objective A completed. Let me switch back to my AK-47 or whatever it's called. AR-33 assault rifles. Whoa, jeez, whoa. Man, they're just waiting on me. What the? <laughs> Paintball is like in the air. I mean, paintball stain, whatever. All right. All I need to do now is get the building plans and then get to Yannis' train. Or, well, I'm going to call him Yannis. He's Alec. We know who he is now, freaking traitor. All right, where's that building at with the building plans? Another track in the stage. Da -da -da. This is a whole nostalgia feel to me. I mean, just... Uh, reminds me when I was in high school and played this game during this time and this is one of the stages and the tracks I re definitely remember real cool alright building plan is it safe yes it is objective D completed now let's finish objective E as in ECW and finish this level All right, there's his train hold on a second though I'm gonna go I wanna finish this level with a bang to say the least hello oh look at that bond is the boss look at that that's that's how you go out that's how you go out with a bang all right guys so that is the end of part 13 i will see you guys in part 14 the train it would be training day fail i just lost my train i thought forget it god bless take care Welcome to part 14 of Time to Play Goldeneye, where I am now at the train level. I got some serious training to do. I fail. And hopefully this level won't derail my train. I thought, okay, that was an obvious pun. That really failed. All right, so this is my first time playing this level on Double O Agent. This is my first time playing a lot of these levels on Double O Agent. And of course, it's easy for me to do it now because I am cheating. 
Well, even back then when I had the Game Shark and the cheats enabled on my 64, I don't think I played these all these levels. And so a lot of these objectives I'm not fully familiar with. I'm going to have some real fun right here. Got to use a rocket launcher in this one, definitely. Both of them. <laughs> They're waiting on me. Yeah, wait on that. Oh, ouch. I'm ouch. I'm invincible. Alright, <laughs> look at you idiots. Can't hurt me. But they can't see me. I'm not in John Cena mode. Man, it's fun blowing up all these crates with a rocket launcher. Yeah, let's blow up, blow up that with a rocket launcher. It's totally not necessary, but cool. Right. Man, a lot more of these guys. Oh, big explosion right there. Nice. I throw a grenade. See how you guys like it when someone throws a grenade at you. Nice. All right, what else can I use here? I mean, I can use anything I want, but what else do I want to use here? Let's just tase him just for the heck of it. <laughs> the taser boy. What about the Taser Boy fans? Oh, shoot! I didn't realize I equipped the tank bullet. <laughs> now, that break over there is all magically destroyed, too. So. All right. Let me see what else I want to use here. Oh! Now, nah, I want to go back to... Oh, let me see here. Yeah, here we go. Oh, nice. You idiot, why'd you run back into the explosion? Idiot, dude, get some run run to the explosion. <laughs> is this the bathroom? Yes, it is. I can't see all this smoke. That's my fault. Let's see what's in this door over here. Wait. There we go. Oh, I guess it's one of the areas where you ride the train at. I think all these rooms look similar, so let's get going here. Let me check this one. Nope. Yep, same thing. That door's locked for some reason. Hmm. Oh, what the heck? I can see where I'm going here. Come on, smoke, hurry up and clear. Yeah, all these rooms. I wonder why some of them are locked. Hmm. I wonder if you can even ever open them up. Probably not meant to open them up. All right, so moving on straight ahead. We're on the train, so it's full speed ahead. All right, so maybe this is the infamous train that always interferes in J-Man's videos. But this time, we're going to put a stop to this train. Oh, you just waiting on me, were you, sir? Let's see what else I want to use here. Let me switch to something else. Oh, yeah, I got to switch to a more uh, discreet gun because I can't be using rocket launchers if I want to rescue Natalia. Come on, die already. Well, these guys have, like, bulletproof vests or something. I'm getting close to Natalia, so I can't be using rocket launchers and stuff and blowing her up. She's not in ECW mode. Need a restroom break. I'm trying to 
Trying to do hop on the table, get out of here. Oh, there's another break thing, whatever it's called. Shoot this idiot right here. Okay, we're gonna switch guns right here. Actually, I'm gonna use a throwing knife right here, real quick. There's a guy hiding right there waiting to ambush me. Let's see if that gets attention. Nope. Let's see if I can hit him. Dang it, stupid corner. No, I can't. Oh! <laughs> Does that hurt? Got you right in the kneecap. Oh, come on, hit him! Oh, there we go. I wonder if I can destroy this break thing with the... The knives. No, I can't. All right, give me a break. All right. Coast, of course, the dough is locked. All right, now we're getting close to Natalia and the Rumov and Trevelyan and um, Xenia. Right, one more break thing over here to destroy that. Then I'll put this, the train to a stop. All right, got the door key. I'm ready to rescue Natalia here. There they are, so here we go. Now, what am I doing, idiot? I'm gonna equip the hunting knife. Throw a knife, see if I can hit a room off here. Nice. Oh, wait. Oh, shoot. He's still alive. Dang it. He's still alive. I thought he was dead. <laughs> what was that about? Oh, that was about me being an idiot. All right. Starting over here again. All right. There we go. All right. All right. Hurry up and do your thing. Crack the code. Track down boards. Whatever you got to do. We're going to watch laser over here to get us out of here. that there we go shut up Alex oh wait a minute he's supposed to give me the same six minutes I gave you which is three minutes but no double agent you know let's do less than a minute all right let's be douchebags well what the heck stop shooting me hold on a second I'm trying to get out of here dude stop shooting me I'm trying to uh, open this trap door douchebag I said leave me alone All right, you hurry up. We got 30 seconds. He's in Cuba. That's great. Let's go. Let me make sure. I think she has to do one more thing. Yes, yeah, she has to crack Boris's password. Well, let's get a move on, honey. We're about to die here. Are you serious? Hurry up. Look, they're taking off in the chopper. That means the train's about to blow up. If you have time. You ain't got much time. Oh, seriously? 10 seconds? Dang, really? Double O agent mode? You're not going to give us that much time? How? Oh, shoot. All right, let's go. Let's go. Oh, shoot. Did she even make it? Oh, what? What was that about? How are you supposed to beat this level if you don't have time? If Natalia won't hurry up and finish in time? How are you supposed to beat this level? Freaking women taking their time and everything in the kitchen, the bathroom, and now cracking a password. Jeez, come on. Of course I'll never win. Because freaking Natalia slowed me down over here. Jeez. All right, let's try this again. Now hurry up before I shoot you my rocket grenade launcher over here. 
Oh yeah, I remember in the movie she goes, Don't stand there, get the stuff out of here. Well, you freaking hurry up, we can get out of here. You're the one that's holding up everything. Oh. Oh wait. She finished soon this time. No, go back down, you idiot. So wait a minute. So I guess all you have to do is leave and she automatically finish? What the heck happened there? Oh, you better hurry. Alright, and oh wait a minute. Well, well, why did she leave then? I thought she finished cracking Boris's password. Apparently not. If you leave automatically, she automatically leaves with you, but you still don't complete the part of the mission. Okay, so you got to shoot, I think, Alec, which I think I just did, to delay time. Or you got to shoot Xenia, I forgot. And he's supposed to get more time to escape. Let's see if that works. I shot Alec, but... I think I gotta shoot Xenia actually to get more time. Let's see. No, they're already counting down. Well, man, really? This is cheap. This is some BS. Hurry up, woman. Ridiculous. So I guess you do have to shoot Xenia to get more time. Yeah, I'm gonna. Well, I'm not gonna die, but she is. I'm gonna fail again. Yeah, well, you're dead. Yeah, you deserve to die. You deserve that. Alright, let me try to shoot, shoot Zinnia here. You must shoot him first. Nah, fell. Get her. Ah, no, ah, dang it. I missed. Man, Alex right. I'm never going to win. Rumov 2 is right. In the movie. You can't win. Ah, dang it, stupid obstruction. Alright, this is an obstruction of justice. Shoot Zinnia. Ah! I know it was aiming for Alec there, but... Oh, dang! Shot him in the neck. Painful death. All right. There! Finally! Got him. Got him that time. Yeah, what? All right. Now let's get the heck out of here. Jeez, man. That part's hard. All right. Hurry up! Hurry. Don't worry. The bullets can't hit you. Nice. Finally. Finally. The train mission is complete. Alright, so I will see you guys in part 15 for the jungle. It's a jungle out there. And it's about to get real. God bless and take care. Welcome to part 15 of Time to Play Goldeneye. It's a jungle out there. Jungle! Welcome to the jungle! Alright, so I gotta destroy drone guns and then make Xenia blow up, blow up and dump, escort Natalia to Yannis base. <laughs> you said dump. <laughs> Alright, so this stony. This stage is kind of lame, and I say that because there's no music, and I get that because it's the jungle, so they want to add jungle sound effects into it and stuff. And, um, yeah, it's not one of my favorite stages. It can be, it really can be a pain, but since I'm cheating, it should be a breeze. If you didn't notice, I selected invents, uh, invents, invisibility. Let's see if that will work here. First, though, I want to equip the AR-33s. If I'm invisible, will she still follow me? Oh, she is. Nice. I really think that will work, but I thought it would be worth a try. 
this is gonna be good. I'm now in John Cena mode. In ECW mode and John Cena mode. Oh yeah, that's right. She can also shoot. She has her Cougar Magnum. Most powerful handgun in the world. All right. The one of the drone guns. She cannot kill the drone gun, so I'm going to have to. Oh, where's she going? Pay attention. I thought I accidentally shot her because she fell down. She was actually rolling. Sorry, Natalia. I didn't leave any guys for you over here. All right. I'm going to give Natalia a chance to shine here. I'm going to kill a few guys my own, but I'm also going to let her kill some people. Maybe, heck, maybe all of them. Nice shot. Oh, that's a nice plant. Come on now. Let's not pay attention to plants. Hey, you disappointed me in the last level, Natalia. Don't disappoint me in this level. Come on. Make yourself useful in this one. Okay. I'm going to stand here and give her a chance to shoot. Oh, she got one. Wait. What are you coming after me for? I was the one that shot you. That's right. Get him. Get him. Where'd she go? What are you looking at? All right. Good job. I'm a little bit lost now. I'm doing some backtracking. I think I'm supposed to go this way. Yep, there we go. Oh, I thought he was shooting at me. I go, wait, how can he see me? Nope. And remember, the drone guns can see you because they, de they detect body heat. Come on, Natalia. Right here, right here. Look. There you go. <laughs> She wants to look cool while doing it. I remember in the movie, Boss said, do you know how to disarm a weapon? And she did. And he goes, don't move. <laughs> Still told her to stay right there. No, over here. Over here. There we go. All right, shoot him. Oh, nice. Oh, here we go. Get ready to fight Xenia. No, I think the pleasure is going to be all hers. Natalia, get her. Don't worry, she can't see you. <laughs> she can see me, but she's not shooting. I'll soften her up a little bit, and I'll let Natalia do the rest. Come on, I'll let you do all the dirty work. Let's go, get her. She's on the bridge. She's burned some bridges with you when she tried to... When she kidnapped you in the last level. Ah, come on now. A little bit slow to the draw. Come on, you can get her. Yes, there you go. Nice. Good job. You completed you completed an objective for me. Good job. All right. So I picked up the RC Pro AM or whatever that gun's called. Alright, so all we gotta do now is destroy the rest of the drone guns, then destroy the ammo dump. Oh, where's she at? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, there she is. Wow. You're good. All right, now get this guy over here. Nice. So I guess she's invisible, too. We're both in John Cena mode. You can't see us. All right. Let me get this drone gun up here. I think this is the last drone gun, or second to the last drone gun. All 
All right. So here, oh, there's the other one. Boom. Destroy. Now destroy the ammo dump. Nice. All right. All we got to do is leave. Come on, Natalia. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Who? Who? Who'd you shoot? I didn't even see that person. Wow. Good eye. And you've really made yourself useful in this level. Now where'd she go now? Come on. What did you fall off the ladder? Where'd she go? Well, what the heck, man? Dang it. Now I gotta go find her. Whoa! Oh, nice! Wow, you're good. You shot him execution style. How's it feel, guys? Dang, you're ugly. Get out of my face. Man, you won't die, will you? I'll let her kill you. Come on. Give him nostalgia. Nostalgia. Natalia. Oh, come on now. How can you miss that? All right, we got to stop messing around here. Let's get out of here. Oh, thank you. All right. Let me get these guys. Oh. All right, come on, Atalia. All right. I want to make sure she leaves with me instead of me leaving. Then it says, I'll drift to fail. You didn't escape from Natalia. All right, there we go, man. Yeah, look at that. You can't mess with both of us now. Natalia redeeming herself here, finally useful for something in this game. All right. So, that is the end of the jungle level. I will see you guys in part 16, where hopefully I will take control of the command center. Until then, God bless and take care. Welcome to part 16 of Time to Play GoldenEye, where I am now in the control center or command center, whatever you want to call it. So all I have to do here is protect Natalia so that she can disable GoldenEye and then destroy all the mainframes, mainframe computers. So that's going to be easier said than done because you really got to protect Natalia. That part is the most challenging part, or at least... Uh, to me it is because I'm cheating, but even with cheat modes enabled, ECW mode, Natalia is not in ECW mode, so and there lies the challenge. Right, so let me destroy all these drone guns, kill all these soldiers real quick so that Natalia will come out. I've used the golden gun on those drone guns and actually worked in one shot, so that's pretty cool. I thought the golden gun would only kill human enemies. With one shot, but no, it kills drone guns too. It's pretty cool. It's pretty much destroys anything with one shot. All right, come on out, Natalia. It's safe. Yeah, yeah, I know I'm wonderful. I love the track in this stage. They really spice it up and make the music sound cool. Oh, that guy was smart. He got out of the way real quick. Whoa, little quick cut editing there because I actually went the wrong way. I saw what you did to Boris on the security monitor. It wasn't very nice. Well, he's a douchebag. He was just a programmer, James. You need to kill him. Yes, I did. He betrayed you, remember? What? What? Well, fine. You know what? Screw you, too. Jeez. He's a douchebag. Fine. I won't kill him then. He pulls a gun, what am I supposed to do? The idiot drops the gun. But yeah, for now. There, Natalia, are you happy? I need to shoot your little friend, Boris. That's a douche. That's all right, he'll get his in the end. All right, now come on. Time to get serious here and go to work. Do your thing. Disable Goldeneye. 
challenging part where I got a protector here. Huh, he's just waiting for the siren to go off. Oh yeah, well, I'm relieving you of your duty. Uh, all right, Golden Eye is set to, to fire on London. God save the queen. All right, here we go. Y'all oscillation, what the heck is that? Hey y'all, how you doing? Oh shoot. Alright. Shut up woman, I'm trying to save your life. You think he could be quiet and disable Goldeneye? Jeez. Oh shoot. Yeah, oh shoot is right, they shooting at me and her, except of course I can't get hit. Hey guys, welcome to the party. Oh shoot, I forgot they and shoot through there. Oh, dang, they got her. Dang. Oh, no. Oh, she's still alive. She has a gun, too. Oh, wow. I guess she is an ECW mode right here. That's weird. Wow. She's hey, cool. She's still alive. That was a close one. I forgot they busted those windows right there. Very sneaky, guys. Very sneaky. Oh, finally, I was about to ask you, are you done yet? All right. Now get out of here. All right, so let's go after Trebellion. There he is. Ah, dang it. Too slow. You guys are slow, too. All right, this is how you destroy the mainframe computers. Duh. Man, it's been a long time since I've done this. Was, you, was this the objective in agent mode? Might have been. Get out of the way, idiot. All right, as Natalia said, I've been clowning around. Time to stop clowning around and get serious here at this level. There's the other one. Is that it? Nope. Still some more. Let's see if I can get to, to land on this guy. Well, no. Uh, I would get out of here if I were you. Oh! I <laughs> told you, idiot. Man, this game just blows you away. It's so great. All right. Where's that other mainframe? Where's it? Ah, I'm trying to be sneaky, huh? All right, this should be the last one. No? What? Jeez, how many more are there? Oh, hello. Here's a welcoming community right here. There it is. Oh, whoa, what the? Oh, what just happened? I think as I was throwing their mine on there, the drone gun or one of the soldiers shot the... the, the uh, the, the uh, proximity mine, whatever they're called, and then blew it up the terminal for me, or maybe they shot the terminal for me. I don't know. That was pretty cool. Thanks, AI idiots. All right, so that's the end of the control center. Next, the caverns. Oh, a level that was not in the movie. It's about to get real. -er. It's still real to me. All right, God bless and take care. Welcome to part 17 of Time to Play Goldeneye. Now I'm in the caverns. 
where I'm about to have some real fun. Notice I selected the invisibility just for a few minutes. I don't want to mess around with Tre Trevelyan here. All right, destroy inlet, outlet, and master controls. Jeez, how many controls do I got to destroy? And then contact Jack Wade. Minimize ca scientist casualties. You know, on agent mode, regular agent mode, all you had to do is just minimize scientist casualties. So the caverns level is real easy on agent mode. And of course, it's real easy now because I'm cheating. All right. Hey, guys. How you doing? Yep. I'm in John Cena mode. You can't see me. But let's see if you can feel me. Well, I guess not. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let's see. These guys can feel me. Yeah, they can. Man, they all got... They got all that body armor on. What the heck, man? Yeah, your face don't have body armor, though, does it? Jeez, man, I know they got body armor, but man. Pwned. Oh, wait. Now he's pwned. I thought he went down. All right. All right, let me get out of here and disable invisibility. And then get on with the level. I love the music in the stage. Another stage that was not in the movie. Yeah, you better run. Trying to be all cool doing some fancy moves. You can't juke and job with me. All right, let me go over here. What the? <laughs> Move, idiot. Are you trying to dance with me or something? Get out of here. Get out of here, dude. Idiot. Thank you for moving. What? What the heck? Where'd you come from? Jeez, man. This guy's got some good armor on. Oh, see? Move, you idiot. If I kill one more, I fail. Move! You want to get killed like your friend. What? Oh, uh, thanks, idiot. You know, double O agent mode is supposed to make things harder. It kind of made things a little easy for me right there by completing the objective for me. All right, let me switch to my trusty rocket launcher. It says destroy pump controls or inlet controls, whatever. Is that how you do it? I forgot. Get out of here. You see this big rocket launcher point at you? Move. See, I don't want to use it right there because I want to kill him because I fail. You know what? Let me, yeah, I'll switch my taser right here. Look, idiot, are you trying to get killed? What is going through him? Oh, went through his head. Yeah, maybe if I taser this big water pump right here, that'll destroy it. No, I'm trying to remember how do I destroy these pump controls or whatever the mission objective is. Maybe a timed mine will destroy this thing. No? Well, what the? I forgot. I'll figure it out later. Let's get moving on. No, let's get moving on. Let's get moving. Nice music. These doors make me think I'm inside the Death Star or some sort of spaceship or something. All right. I'm in this section here. The big, deep chasm. With the rocket launcher, see if I can hit from here. Nice. Aw oh, man, I wish I wish you would knock him to the water. That'd be cool. I'm gonna shoot up here, see how far 
Here we go. Nice. Yawn. Ah! Got caught sleeping on the job. Oh, this is going to be fun. Lots of crazy to show. Whoa, where these guys come from? <laughs> what? Oh, man. These guys are tough. It's like Beep is going crazy with the rocket launcher. Yeah, yeah, destroy everything. Yeah, man. <laughs> Hurry up, Beep. Beat the level. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, hello. Goodbye. Dang it, I missed. What are you gonna do? Freaking Teddy Cruz shooting at me. Oh, let's go down here. Well, what do you want? You really? Get out of here, Geraldo. Lockers down here. What the, why is there lockers down here? I guess because construction work or coal miners, or whatever, here in this freaking cavern. <laughs> well, it's time to clear your locker out because you're all fired. Oh, I'm sorry. Was that your locker that pissed you off? Who else wants some? Who else wants some of Debo? What's going to 40, homie? How's the other guy not see me yet? What? He's like, I'll let, I'll let that guy do all the work. Oh, that's what you get for being lazy. Went out with the bang. Let's see if I hit this guy from here. Yeah. What? Oh, that's BS. I know they have body armor on, but come on. Oh, about time. Jeez. Man, that guy was tough. That guy had semi ECW mode. get for being all cool. Man, someone's firing me big time. Oh wait, it's a drone gun. Alright. Shut up.
Really? You're going to come charging out to me like you're all cold? You don't see this rocket launcher in my hand. All right. More controls to destroy. Okay. I feel stupid. And I thought that big water pump over there was like one of the pump controls. No, it was these computers. Oh, nice. Nice. Objective B completed. Destroy master control con console. Use radio to contact Jack Wade. Card. Oh, what? Where'd you come from? I thought everybody was dead in this section. See if I miss anything else over here. In case I need any more key cards. Try something over here. Let me see if I can throw a grenade in this water. What the heck, man? That's lame. Boo, boo. Too bad you can't really throw in the water and then watch it explode in the water. Oh well. There's the radio to contact Jack Wade. We gotta be careful though not to kill these scientists. So let me switch to something a little more discreet. Oh, what? Oh, you idiots! You're gonna freaking throw away, throw a bomb and destroy everything, cause me to fail. It's all y'all's fault. Ah! All you would die. Ah! Pick up another code card. Doesn't matter now. I think also, I think they, they completed an objective for me, destroyed those controls, and then it caused me to fail two objectives at the same time. So I succeeded and failed at the same time. Only I could do that. Jeez. All right, so let's start over here. I'm going to see if I can actually chase the building all the way down. Well... Dang, I'm losing them. Dang it. Open the door. Forget it. I lost it. Oh, well. I think he goes all the way to the very end to the elevator. Since he has all the key cards, of course, so he can get through all the doors. But I, um, failed to keep track of him right there, but that's okay. We'll, we'll get him eventually. Get out of the way, you idiot. That's your first warning. Really? You really want to die, don't you? What, you think it's funny? Yeah, that's what I thought. You know, for scientists, they're freaking idiots in this game. Dude, get out of my way! How stupid are you? Move. But these guys are a little bit smarter now. Nice. 
I complained about how you can't knock the enemies off of here. Well, at least you can't fall off of here either. See, why can't enemy gunfire kill enemies? Now that'll make it a little too easy. Nice little pink gun you got there. What are you gonna kill me with a little your little water gun? Come on. <laughs> wow, nice colorful gun you got there. Look at these paintball spots on these wires. Ha! <laughs> cool. What was that? That's what I thought. Alright, let's be careful here not make the same mistake again. Well, actually, it's their dumbass fault. Yeah, gotta, gotta prevent them from throwing a grenade at me and end up killing themselves and all the scientists. And, oh, look, he just threw one at me already. Yeah, that's right. Throw it over here, not at yourselves like idiots. All right here. Be careful, because I think they might throw grenades at me again if I get too close. Well, shoot, I have to risk it here. You gotta be quick to the draw. Don't throw another grenade. Don't throw another grenade. Oh no, you idiot! No, 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 no! Oh, thank God. I want to kill one scientist. Good. And the radio is still intact. Yes. Objective D completed. Now I can destroy these controls. Objective C completed. Nice. <laughs> it kind of destroyed that computer out there. It kind of didn't. All right. That's the code card. Ah, oh, jeez. What? Maybe if I manually select it. No, let me try B. No, well, I guess I'm missing another code card. What the heck is that? Right, let's go look for it. All right, object to be completed again. There it is. All right. What are you doing, you idiot? You can't radio Jack Wade. Get out of here. All right, now let's go. Oh, that hurt right in the leg. Oh, wait. Dang it, that's where I came from. Here we go. <laughs> he was still holding his leg. All right. So slow, man. Get it again. I still got you, though. Boom, I shot you a few times. I'm slow right now because I'm invincible. Man, he just disappeared in the elevator. You see that? Wow. Nice. All of a sudden, they disappear. All right. That is the end of the caverns. It is now time for the final showdown with Alec Trevelyan, the long-awaited showdown at the Cradle. See you in part 18. Till then, God bless. Take care.
Welcome to part 18 of Time to Play Goldeneye, where we are now in the cradle. It's time for the final showdown with Trevelyan. Time to rock the cradle. Destroy console, control console, settle the score with Trevelyan. Whoa, jeez. What? <laughs> wow, trippy. It's half day and half night. Wow, that's scary. And the cradle, too, over there looks like it's part of the sky. This is creepy. I like it. All right, here we go. Time to rock and roll. Whoa, even the enemies look glitched out right there. All right. Uh-oh. Now, I never played this level on Double O Agent. So I'm not sure how to disable it. I'm trying to remember how he did it in the movie. He just put a bar between the chains or whatever, and it messed up the the, the antenna. It couldn't reposition. Get my rocket launcher here. It would be nice to shoot Trevelyan with a rocket launcher. Whoa, it just went through the cradle. Dang it. Wait a minute. Yo. Oh, you can't shoot the enemies with a rocket launcher this level? That's lame. Well, the fun with the rocket launcher is over, so that's all right. Yeah. Now what? Wait a minute. Let's go back in circles. It's the beginning. I don't even need the body armor. What the heck? Ah, fail. Looks like I went back to the beginning there. What the heck? What? All right. Probably down here somewhere. Is that it? I think this is it. If I remember correctly, you destroyed that. Oh, what the heck? Well, fail. No, I can't drop down there yet. Well, I could, but it will do no good. Trevelyan's not down there yet. Well, oh, I thought that was him. Get out of the way. Oh, there he is. Yeah, I'm gonna fail this mission. I'm gonna have to go back and try it again because I forgot how to destroy the antenna. Whoa, whoa, some guy's waiting for me. Oh, wait, that's Trevelyan. <laughs> and I'm, I failed the mission. I'm going to fail the mission, but uh, it's not going to stop me from having a little fun with 006 as I settle the score with him. He thinks he can play around with me. No, I'm going to play some games with him. I think it's not really the beginning, but there's body armor everywhere, which is cool to have because the double O agent is hard. If I was going in circles there, I'm not. It's just the part, the section of the cradle. It looks like it's the beginning. Yeah, just imagine going outside and then seeing like, or standing on a on a platform like this and seeing half the earth is dark. And half his light, that'd be cool. Love the track right here. Really gives you that sense of urgency, like, right, this is it. This is the final party. I sell the score to Is that him? No. I'm sure he's posted up waiting for me. I still want to see if I hit this guy. Boom. Alright, 
where to go from here. Go down here. I really thought this had to destroy the antenna control. I guess not. Hmm. All right, who are you, Trebellion? Trying to sneak up on me like that. What? The paintball right there. All right, Trebellion, what the heck are you at? It's like you've been everywhere. One big antenna. There you are. I saw him through a grenade. It's pretty fast. Yes, that's the best I can do. I'm cheating. You already failed. Just like Eddie Guerrero said, if you're not cheating, you're not trying. Yes, I will win. Well, not right now, because I failed the mission already, but I went eventually. Oh, yeah? What? Uh, are you better now? No, oh, for me. Then I jump. Yeah, what is life? What is life now? What to do with my life? Trevelyan is gone, so I'll just end my life too. All right, we're gonna start again here. This time the twist. I'm gonna enable invisib yeah, invisibility and slow animation. This is gonna be something. Look at that, even Bond is slow. Oh. Okay, good. Now at least not slow the actual gameplay. one of the soldiers. Wait a minute. No, that's Alec. Well, hey, Javelin. Hey. Talking to you. Hey. I'm going to shoot with you. Now, who? Now who's too slow, huh? Now who's too slow? Yeah, not moving. Not moving too fast there, are you, Javelin, huh? <laughs> Just... Shooting him in the back of the head like nothing. Whoa. Dude, you're still ugly. Seriously. Look at that freaking beaver. Alright. <laughs> Reminds me of a commercial. I don't know if it's a burger commercial or what. There's people playing basketball on the court and they were moving all slow. And then the people courtside were like moving at normal speed and they stole their food and ran off and of course what the other guys gonna do they can't run because they're freaking slow <laughs> oh, the drone guns aren't slow though Spot where he stops, supposed to meet me. Oh, oh, wait a minute. What's the matter? No glit remark? No pit to come back?
Missed. There we go. here and take out the rebellion. That's how you destroy the control 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 console. And I felt stupid after I found that out. I tried to destroy the actual whole thing. The console, whatever. Now that it's been destroyed now it's time to take out rebellion. Now what? Oh he's fast now. Face sickens me. Actor Sean Bean. Pretty good actor. Did a great job portraying Trevelyan in this movie. Oh yeah, I am still invisible right here. So, he's the only one that can see me. Alright, it's time to finish the job. Go down the stairs or the ramp. <laughs> the paintball shots everywhere. That's nice. Oh, oh, that'd be funny if I fell off right there and died. Oh, you're always better? Well, you're not now. Bringling James? No. For me. Oh, I'd be messed up if he got sliced by the helicopter blades. <laughs> or if he just missed right there, that would suck. That paintball shots are still up there on the cradle. Nice. All right. Trevelyan finally, finally pwned. Yes, I'm all right. Let's make out. The lips aren't even touching. So yeah, this is what basically happens at the end of the movie. They make out, and, but they're, instead they're in open field, not the jungle. And then Jack Wade and his men arrive out of nowhere in, in case Bond needed backup. Pretty good ending to the movie. They could have done better with the ending here. But back then I didn't care. It says Dr. David Doak in the credits. So that's so I guess that is a person that has an actual name. Dr. Dork, freaking traitor. Back then I didn't care about this ending being kind of lame now that, that like this is all they show but at least it does match the ending to the actual movie they could have still done maybe a little bit more with it but anyway all right so the cradle has been defeated the cradle's been defeated as if the cradle's the actual person trevelyan has been defeated so all the main levels in the game have been cleared and remember, there's still two more left. So I'm not done with this LP yet. I like this rocking track right here. Alright, the actors. Ron Moore. James Bond. They had to put him in that Siberian suit, really. Natalia Super Su Su Supernova. Sean Bean, Zinnia, I forgot her name, she also played, was she in the first Rush Hour movie? Was it, no, was it Rush Hour or was it I Spy with Owen Wilson and Eddie Murphy, I forgot, anyway, notice these uh, animations right here and how they're posing and stuff, like some of them it doesn't make sense, like I'll show you here in a minute, like a scientist with a golden gun, yeah right, come on. Helicopter pilot. When do we see that? I guess in the end right there, but it looked like I thought 
I know in the movie Natalia forces the look at these civilians like they're acting all badass now. You weren't acting all badass when you run around the streets with your hands up. There's Red Foreman. <laughs> and as I was saying, Natalia was force forcing the helicopter pilot to fly away or to pick up Bond. I don't know if you actually saw the pilot right there. I have to go back and look, but Man, he's co coked up. Uh, here's some enemies we haven't seen yet. What? Her? Psh. Mayday. Grace Jones. Jaws. Odd job. Or Archangel Zero. Baron Samedi. Alright, so that's the end of part 18 for Goldeneye. Remember, we still got two more levels left. Until then, God bless. Take care. Welcome to part 19 of Time to Play GoldenEye, where I am now in the Aztec Complex. One of the two bonus levels in this game. So I got to reprogram shuttle guidance, launch shuttle. All right, so here we go. I think I did beat this level on Secret Agent back in high school. It was not easy. Now I'm on double O agent, but this time I'm cheating. <laughs> All right, let's get going here. I think there's two guards. Yep. Really been a long time since I played this. Oh, what's the matter? Are you choking? Choking on a bullet. Nice moves. All right, let's get going here. What the? Well, where do I go? What the heck? Um, I forgot. Well, am I? If, oh wait, that's right. Hello, hidden passage. And this right here is very hard to get by in Double O Agent because that guy in the background shooting at you. What the heck? I guess that guy dropped a grenade. He's trying to throw a grenade too. Okay. Now I forgot how to reprogram whatever the heck I'm supposed to do, so this is going to be fun. Watch me try to figure all this out. Well, how do you... Yeah, I think I need a security card to get in there. Yeah, bulletproof, bulletproof glass. Yeah, I think I need a key card or something from a soldier. All right, let's move on. No, I... Jeez. So that's a... How that guy not see me? He's just standing there. So mainframe has a door trying to trick me here. What the... Get up. Now get back down. What is this? Oh, that closes the door. Hey. And the other guys don't hear me. With this loud Russian gun. Oh! Let's see if I hit the other guy from here. Yeah. Jeez, man. Oh, shoot. Come at me, bro. Oh, wait a minute. What these computers do? I forgot. Wait a minute. Am I supposed to get out of here? Oh, shoot. What the heck? Oh. Oh. 
Oh well, I'm invincible anyway. Who was shooting at me? Oh, there they are. What the heck? Nice. Okay, I'm right below the rocket here, the shuttle. Well, how do I get out of here now? Am I, am I stuck? This door won't open. Wait. Oh, yeah, that's right. You can go through these vents. I forgot about that. That's a troll move. How are you supposed to figure that out? I forgot how I figured it out. I might have looked through players' guides. Probably got lucky. Oh, shoot. Drone gun. Oh, it's another one. Oh, nice colorful drone gun there. What if that was another weapon you could use in your arsenal with the drone gun? That'd be stupid, but kind of funny. That body armor, like I need it. Alright, whoa, more drone guns here. Come on, I'm hitting it. Man, jeez. Alright, you guys over here think you're all cool. Hide behind these boxes. Trying to shoot at me. Alright, I'm trying to make sure that thing's destroyed. Alright, am I supposed to do something over here? I think so, I forgot. I think this computer launches the rocket? I forgot. That was a dumb move on my part because if it was going to launch the rocket, I would have failed the mission already because I haven't completed Objective A yet. Okay, that closes the exhaust bay. I mean, you got to exhaust all possibilities in this level. Alright, well, I'm trying to remember what the heck to do here. going here okay I just went in a circle like an idiot a sec is that it no there's gonna be more to it is there another hidden passage oh wait Psh, idiot all right yeah here we go all right oh shoot there's jaws Ah, the guy down there saw me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill Jaws my rocket launcher real quick. Ah, he got the weight. What? Man, Jaws is tough. The heck? Oh, he rolled out way of that one. I, I don't think a rocket can kill him anyway. Fine, I'll use. Uh, Golden gun, see how tough you are then. Oh, pwned. Picked up a smart card. Hmm, that's probably what would get me through the bulletproof doors. Uh, bulletproof glass. What the heck? That, that took more than one shot. I got two golden guns here, and that guy still withheld it, but Jaws couldn't. I think because I shot the gun first, that's why. I shot his gun first instead of him. I got two golden guns. What's more dangerous? Then a man with a golden gun. A man with two golden guns. The sequel. Whoa, what's over here in the darkness? Oh, what the heck? A golden bullet to the leg. Hey, nothing's over here. Let's go back. I can play an Ocarina of Time now or something. Or one of those, Spirit Temple or something. And I think it's supposed to be cloudy, but because the graphics plug in with this emulator, it's, there's no clouds. 
All right. All right, got the silver PPK here. Nice. Where am I going? Am I going in a circle again? Moron, let's figure out where we're going here. Whoa. What was he doing? Reloading his gun or about to throw a grenade? That is what you get for trying to be cool. All right, let's move on. Yeah, I think I need to go back to that control room, whatever it was, with the bulletproof glass. Two PPKs now. Nice, beautiful guns. I mean, I'm tired of gold. I don't get silver for a change. All right. Picked up a dat. All right. What am I supposed to do right here? Use this right here. The disk drive is connected to the guidance computer systems. Okay, how about tell me what to do? Dude, hold on a second. Try to figure this out. Oh, look at these idiots. They're smiling like peekaboo. Thank <laughs> you. You want to shoot me, but you can't. All right, so try to figure out what to do. I mean, um, well. Kill this idiot first. All right. Man, more idiots. Like, geez, are these soldiers unlimited? No limit soldiers. Master P up in here. It's not mainframe. It's a door. All right. Exhaust pay opening. And this level is getting me exhausted. How did you see that? He just like floated up there and he got knocked back down. Cool. Oh, what's the matter? You can't shoot me, can you? Look at you running around like idiots. Look at that. They can actually shoot through the floor. That's cheap. I mean, if I wasn't cheating, that would be so cheap and make me so mad. Where'd the ladder go? I don't even see the ladder anymore. Boom. I like how you just jump down without dying. Maybe that's because I'm invincible. I don't know if you actually get hurt falling off like that. Oh, uh huh. That's what you get, moron. You do run up on me like you know, ah, like Rambo, then you just die like an idiot. Man, they're hitting me. They're on target. But of course, I'm invincible. <laughs> Now the ladder shows up. Oh, got him in the neck. Well, that, you're a pain in the neck, so karma got you back. Now die. All right. stupid because I figured out what to do here. There we go. All I need to do now is launch the rocket and I'm good to go. I 
got to open the exhaust bay first, of course, then launch the rocket. Or the shuttle, whatever you want to call it. Whoa. Ha, cool. Now, I can't destroy that mainframe, at least. That's good. Use the uh, launch protocol. All right. Now we get ready for liftoff. This part was intense to me when I was a kid because you got to try not to get killed right here while you wait for it to to lift off. Come after me, somebody! I dare you. Man, those lasers can go through the floor, I guess, because they're lasers. Next is the Egyptian Temple. But first, I want to do something real quick. I want to stand right here when the shuttle launches just to see what will happen. I know I'm not going to die, but I want to see if he'll let me, to see if he'll still show me here or whatever. There's some guys behind me trying to get through the door like idiots. What? Okay, I'm standing right there all of a sudden. That's weird. And you can barely hear a guy scream, Ugh! because one of the idiots trying to get through the door was close to the rocket and... And the fire got him. That was cool. All right. So that is the end of part 19 of GoldenEye. I will see you guys in the last part, which will be part 20. Time to play, discuss GoldenEye, where I finally finished this LP. All right. Until then, God bless. Take care. Welcome to Time to Play Discuss Goldeneye, where I am in the Egyptian Temple and the last bonus level. So yeah, here we go. I don't remember too much about the Egyptian Temple, but you just have to kill Baron Samedi or Baron Samadi, however you say his name, whatever. All right, so here we go. Recover the Golden Gun, defeat Baron Samedi. What does mean question mark? Am I supposed to do that or not? Anyway. Well, wait. Oh, I'm sorry. Welcome to Time to Play Discuss The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time where I'm in the Spirit Temple. All right. I see you. Oh, shoot. Oh, oh I thought that was a swimming pool. That part right there, the swimming pool, looks like that one part that Bond was swimming at in the movie. Where Xenia attacks him. Then throws her butt on that stove. Burns her butt. She got butt hurt. Alright, so anyway. Let me hunt down Baron Samedi. Well, there he is. I assume you cannot kill him yet. You must recover the golden gun. Hello. See, I thought he had a golden gun. He doesn't. He has those Desperado guns. So, of course, he's not dead yet. Why won't you die? He has ECW mode. Here we go now. Got two of my favorite guns in the game. Where the heck you at? Oh, hey, Dr. Dope. Hello again, Dr. Dork. All right, got Hitler and other people shooting at me here. So it's a dead end. Where do I go here? Come on. I know there's more places to go to than here. No, whoa, dude, I'm, I shot you like 200 times in the crotch. How do you not? Man, Jesus, tough. <laughs> this 
instead of body armor, he must have a, a cup on too to protect his genitals. I'm gonna switch to the golden gun here. Yeah. Well, mission complete. I got the golden gun, right? <laughs> no, of course not. Where the golden gun is at. What the heck? First of all, it gets the bulletproof glass again. Not even the golden gun can shatter it. Second, these drone guns. What the? Even the golden gun can't kill these drone guns? Jeez, what the heck? It's a trap. Give my AR 33 assault rifles here. Wait, what? Are you serious? Wow, fail. I, even these guns can't beat the drone guns. Wow, what the heck is this about? Okay, well, looks like I'm going to have to start over here. Fishing mailed. Come on, drone guns. Do it for me. Ah, of course not. All right, let me start over here again. <laughs> what? Ah, oh, your gun protects you. Lucky. All right, Seth Green. How about a golden bullet to the head? All right. Let me find that room again. Here we are. So apparently you gotta go on a certain path, like a trial and error here. Okay, I think you go left first, then right, left again over here, then right. Oh, nice. All right, time to retrieve the golden gun now. To where I have three golden guns. All right, and. Wait a minute. Objective A completed, right? Well, who the heck's shooting at me? There's nobody in here. Objective A completed, right? How come it's not letting me complete it? I got three golden guns and the door's locked. Don't tell me I'm locked in here. You gotta be kidding. What is going on here? Locked in? So I guess because I'm cheating, the game is confused because I already have the golden gun, so it didn't recognize me as picking up the golden gun and so I guess in order to get to get out of the room you gotta get the golden gun so it still thinks I haven't been, I've complete objective A well that's fail come here alright Baron Samedi is dead why are you scratching your butt well, I guess because he itches what are you still alive I killed you with the golden gun. Oh, let me guess. It's not the golden gun from that room that the game doesn't recognize me picking up. What the heck, man? Oh, what the heck, man? Man, 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 man. Hey, Vince McMahon? All right, let me double check here. Yeah, what the heck? Well, this is... Well, this is awkward. Some hater, oh, that's what you get for cheating. Yeah, hello, Ron Moore from the TV show Cheaters. We've been watching you cheat for years on YouTube. Want to explain yourself? Yeah, I'm cheating because I'm not good at these games. All right, Pwn, shut up. All right, those drone guns can be destroyed with a golden bullet. Uh, there's a ray of sunshine even though it's nighttime because of the video plug-in. Alright, let's move over here. Jeez, where is Baron Samedi? This guy's a troll. Cool track in the stage. Baron Samedi in the Edition Temple. What Bond movie was that in? Or is it is this a custom made level? Custom made enemy, I don't know.
What? You're dead. Dude, you're dead. It's like he's the one that has the body armor. Finally. What well, cheese? Oh, oh, nice. Object to be completed. Okay. So, first of all, how am I going to beat this level if Objective A is apparently not completed? Second, how do you exit out of here? I think usually right there, when you're not cheating, when you beat Baron Samedi, I guess the game goes to a cutscene of Bond walking away. I've never been here before, these blue fours. I'm in the Ice Temple now in Ocarina of Time. Or is this a Temple of Time from Twilight Princess? Oh, I can't see it. Oh, here we go. Alright. Indiana Jones and Temple of Doom up in here. Okay, I've already been in there. What? I'm lost now. This is not fun. Forget it. I'll use footage from YouTube like I've been doing. Alright, so look at Bond walking away like a smooth criminal. His work here is done. What? He's alive. He's alive. Man, he really is a troll. And that laugh is creepy. Alright, so that is the end. Of the Egyptian Temple. And that is the end of this LP. GoldenEye 007 for Nintendo 64. I had a lot of fun doing this LP. And yeah, I had to use footage in some parts of this LP. Yeah, so I had help from Grozlu 00 if I said his name right. Check out his channel by clicking on the link in, his, in the description box. He is very good at GoldenEye. And yeah, so GoldenEye 007 for Nintendo 64. Um, along with Revenge and Ocarina of Time. Back in 98, I really played this game a lot. Was never good in multiplayer, but I loved the facility. I, I would always call it the bathroom level. And that was before I watched the movie. Me and my friend, we would play GoldenEye a lot. He owned the game. And then after that, we watched the movie together. So we we played the game first before we seen the movie. And so we would watch like the movie, and then like we would go, Oh, man, there's the facility. All right, yeah, there's the bathroom part. And then there's the dam, and then there's the uh, archives level, and there's the cradle level. Oh, cool, yeah. So, yeah, I mean, uh, this game was very fun, and the movie is very excellent as well. Later on, I finally owned my own copy of Golden. I had it, I had it for years until I had to sell my whole collection a few years ago for financial reasons, which I didn't want to do, but I had to. So, yeah, I kind of wanted to do this LP for a very, very long time, but I could not because I did not have... A computer that can handle 64 games at the time even though it handled ocarina time but for those of you who have seen that lp you can tell my computer can barely handle it but i got a new computer since then and i also did mario kart 64 you might think well how'd you do mario kart 64 on your computer that was done on vina 22's computer so that's why you didn't see me do many games for 64 because my old computer couldn't handle it finally got a new computer this past summer and now I'm able to do 64 games. So that's why I did Revenge. Well, actually, I had to... It was, it was very complicated. I had to... I still, I was still having technical difficulties with this emulator. As you guys know, the video plug-in was preventing the sky from being shown, which is why the cradle and other levels looked weird. The frigid, frigate, whatever, and, and uh, where you're in a black void. It, so it looked pretty cool, though. It was cool for entertainment purposes, but... Yeah, I can't, I can't seem to find the right emulator. Or you got to configure it right. I don't know how to do all that stuff. And that's one of the reasons why I like sticking to old school games. It's more simpler to work on on YouTube. But yeah, I finally got got to do this game. GoldenEye was very, very fun. So many great memories with it. And I did unlock the invincibility cheat legit back in high school. That was before I had Game Shark. So I was able to... What what I did was I went to the yet yet you had to beat the facility on Double O Agent in like thirty seconds. 
or something like that. It was very, very hard. And after many, many tries, I finally did it. And I, I think I explained that a little bit during the uh, facility part of the LP. But yeah, this game, I mean, freaking ECW. It should be called GoldenEye ECW instead of GoldenEye 007. Um, and yeah, this is one of my top favorites of all time. And I really enjoyed it. And I was glad to finally be able to do this LP. So with that said, I give this game a 9.5 out of 10. Love this game so much. And the game is much more fun when you cheat. Just to mess around and goof off. I've had so many fun memories cheating. Using invisibility and slapping people in the face. And they're like, whoa, who did that? What the heck? And, oh, man. So this LP was very, very fun to do. All right, guys. That is it. I am out of here. Hope you enjoy this LP. And thank you very much for watching. I'm Ron Borb, and God bless, and take care.